Oh my god. I am all kinds of messed up right now. My blood sugar was too low. I was dying. I was perishing. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Spent six, six hours at the salon today. Six hours. He said that it would take two. He said that it would take two hours. That's what he said. And I was falling asleep, man. I was closing my eyes. I was going to bed. I didn't have anything to eat for like eight hours straight. I was starving. <sighs> oh my goodness. And I didn't have any time to style it. It looks... <laughs> I think... I think any... Six hours, yes! He bleached it three times. Three times bleach and color. And a trim. He cut off all the dead ends. I I know exactly what I look like, by the way. I hope y'all can figure it out. Um, am I kept my uh, three? Yes. I thought that he was just going to do it twice, but then he did three. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Also, I have the green screen up, so it's going to look janky, you guys. It's going to look janky, all right? Oh, got pop up on my screen. Get the heck out of here. Get the heck out of here, you stupid thing. It's a miracle that you still have hair. In the color, in the color phase, I could smell burning hair. And he was cutting somebody else's head. And I was like, bruh, I can smell the burning hair. You have to come fix it. Unstyled hair? Oh, no. It's not like it's always unstyled. Okay. Here's a reveal. Bing, bang. Also, Pedro, what's up? How are you doing? Dylan Lion, what's up? Best Olivia, what's up? Lupus. What's up, Kawaii Peaches? Rosera, Cats Invasion. What the heck's going on? Oh my God! Okay, you guys, here's the hair. It's again, again. The, the green screen's kind of weird, but oh wait, I can just I can just show it off this way. Hi, I'm in a boat. Also, uh, have a clip clap clue. Look, I'm in the void. I'm in the purple void. What's up? Check out the hair. It's super white. And look at the back. It's all layered, dude. It's all fancy. I apparently have like natural layers. That's what he that's what he said. Can you see him? Can you see the natural layers back there? It's so white. It's so white. It's Kenny the White. The only question is, are we gonna keep the beard, dude? Are we gonna keep the beard? Now, he straightened the hair too. And because he straightened it, I look very much like a character. Very much like a character. Um, I think I look like the, the girl slash boy. I don't actually know what their gender is. I look like the character from Nier Automata. That's what I look like. I look like the character from Nier. Or Nair? Nier? That anime game? I look like the anime babe. I just need the, I just need the, uh, the eye covers. That's what I need. Uh, because it's like curled on the- <laughs> he straightened it! Uh, you say get rid of the beard? I- I gotta get rid of it. The beard's either getting cut, or it's getting trimmed. Like, it has to be gone. It- it looks so weird. Uh, look, it, like, look at that transition! Look, that's my normal hair. That's what it turned into, but he trimmed around the edges, trimmed the back. Uh, and he, uh, and he cut off the little- the little split ends. It's definitely 2B. That's what it is. That's what it is. I should shave all the beard off and put on the blindfold and I could be near. I just have to get, um, I just have to get a blindfold and then we'll be good. Okay. There you go. Here's the hair, you guys. I'm glad that y'all like it. You finally got a mullet and I got cool white hair. Yo, Texan bread. Nice. Mullet? Mullet vibes? That's pretty rad. Did I get purple shampoo? I got like color safe shampoo. And I got a uh, what? What is it? Yeah, I'm telling you, that's immediately what I thought of Alk. And I w and I like asked the guy while he was styling it. I was like, "Is this like a Korean style or something?" And he was like, "No, no, 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 no. I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm just drying it out and getting ready to cut it." And then he kept teasing me about it. And I was like, "I don't have anything against Korean styles. Korean styles cool. I was just trying to guess what you were doing. That's all." Uh, KJP, what's up? I haven't seen you in forever. I've been wondering how you've been doing. Oi, KJP, good to see you. How how have you been? Also, Anne, what's up? I'm glad you like the hair. Do I like the hair? I feel like I feel like this fixes my fixes my appearance. Honestly, honestly, whenever I every time that I've looked in the mirror, I put on some glasses and I was like, okay, this is the way. That, I mean, just look at these. Let me grab the glasses. They're in the kitchen.
Yo, so dang stylish. I feel so stylish right now. I feel like the embodiment of style. I feel like I could I could get up to all sorts of mischief. What's up? How are you doing? Com complete? Com complete? What's up, complete? How are you doing? The beard's fluffy. Okay. It is. Ah! <laughs> Why did it rotate like that? Why did it rotate like that? Uh, you got to upgrade and artist. That's on my list. I was planning on doing that today, but it took four hours longer than I expected, man. Barbecued children. What's up? How are you doing? Uh, <laughs> spin. Mega spin. Look out for the mega spin. Uh, the beard's super fluffy. That's a whole new vibe. That's what I'm saying. It's fancy, man. But let me see. What, uh, KJP, did you say, did you say what was up? I missed you. Have you been a, have you been a busy bean? A, a busy, a busy friendo. Shaving beard stream? That doesn't even sound interesting. <laughs> the glasses and beard combo make you look like Bo Burnham? What? I've got a completely different, like, face shape to Bo. Also, I'm not funny. So that doesn't, that doesn't track. Uh, but what's up, Independent Oreo? How are you doing? A little short stream today, you guys. This is unexpected, unexpectedly long um, barbecue. What now? It's barbecued children, don't you know? Uh, but yes, because because of the unexpectedly long hair thing, I I still want to get stuff done. I have like a lot of plans today to get some some cool stuff set up for you guys. I want to get some like sweet stuff set up for the weekend. But boy, oh, you'll be lurking. All right, we'll see you later, awkward. I, I don't think I need to wear the wear the glasses the entire time, right? Tasty, mmm, delicious barbecue children. <laughs> That's horrible. That's disgusting. Shaving beard stream. I, you guys, this is not gonna happen. I mean, what am I gonna? Is that a wig? <laughs> no. <laughs> that's what. That's what the stylist said. He was like. You should go to your friends and say that you got your hair shaved and that you have a wig now, but it's not. Look at how white it is. This is all in one in one thing. <laughs> I look like I look like 2B. I look like 2B from the Near series. <laughs> that's what I that's what I think anyway. <laughs> Pull it off. I can't and I'm not pulling on my scalp. I Felix, I have freaking, it got bleached three times. It got bleached three times. I'm not, I'm not making my scalp suffer any more than it already has. It's already, it's already on the ropes. It's already on the ropes. What's going on? We just jumped into this game. I couldn't hear the gnome sound effect. You're now truly Kenny White. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's why I did it. I did it because I was like, I have to match my, I have to match my last name. It's the only, it's the only way to go. Oh yeah, we gotta cook some meat. I'm starving. I'm starving. It's not a gwig. It's not a nelf. It's a gnome. Pull it off. Pull it off. Pull it off. Shut up, Felix. <laughs> Felix, you're being toxic. Felix is being toxic. Mods, take care of him. Take care of him. He's been nothing but trouble. Been nothing but trouble since the very beginning. It says ba Bandar Cal Cal Bandar Cafila. Bandar Kafala, everybody. That means happy birthday, Felix. Okay. Hey, what's up with the? How did you just hit me out of this boat? What was Ness on? Was Ness just like uh, just floating? How'd Ness get up here? Huh? Somebody explain. Why is Ness so powerful? Oh wait, I'm starving. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Ban me. Woo, <laughs> Felix. Felix has been extra sussy recently. Did we get a shout out for Felix? Can we get a shout out for Felix? You're on that acorn grind? <laughs> Awkward. Enjoy your lurk and your grind. You're lurking your grind? Lurking and grinding. KJP said, uh, super busy, but the new thing is that I've been learning and taking Korean classes. Ooh, that's so cool. That's so cool. I was thinking the entire time that I was in the, uh, that I was getting my hair done. They were, they were speaking, I'm pretty sure that they were speaking Mandarin. I'm pretty sure, because I recognize I recognize the sounds of Mandarin. I know it wasn't Japanese. I know it wasn't Korean. Pretty sure it was Mandarin, and I was like, I wish that I knew all of the languages so that I could talk. But what? Take a sip? I don't have any <laughs> I don't have any water on me. Felix, do I look like a healthy streamer right now? I ate three chicken nuggets just to get my uh, just to get my blood sugar up. 
pour it on your new hair. Get some, get some, get some G fuel and dye that hair red, baby. Get some, get some red G fuel. Mm -mm -mm. It's got the food dye in it. It'll, that'll, that'll color it real nicely. Uh, Ness is the shark. Are you talking about Nessie? Who's the, oh, Ness is the shark. I see. Thought you were talking about my friend Nessie and I was like, pretty much. That checks out. It's true. Do we need a fun pizza tonight or what? Listen. Listen, I'm not going to tell you no, but I'm also not going to beg for food, okay? I can feed myself. I'm a grown adult in things, and I get things done and stuff. Felix, good night. Get some rest, you, you crazy cucumber you. Crazy cucumber. I'm glad that you saw my new hair. You were the only person that I, that I wanted to see it, to be honest. To be honest, whenever I got my hair did, I was like, if Felix is not there, then it's not worth it. That's what I said to myself. But uh, I'm so glad that you saw it. Thank goodness. I can I can rest in peace now. Now I can rest in pieces. But yes, enjoy your sleep or else don't play Cookie Run going to bed. You're probably not even playing Cookie Run anymore. Let's be honest. No, nobody plays Cookie Run anymore except for me. I'm the la I'm the final the final straw. The final straw of Cookie Run. Everyone else has moved on to other games. Oh no. <laughs> not the nar. Don't hit me with the nar. Hit me with the nair. Let me nair off all my new hair. That's what I need. No more wigs. No more wigs. The streamer said that his hair was burning earlier. Now we're gonna have to give it a real burn. Uh, b -b 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 what are we gonna do? B -b 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 Let's get out the b -b -b -b. There, now we're ready to go to the island. Onto the island, everybody. Come with me. Come with me. Huh? Last time you begged for food, Spressy gave him money. Do you want me to do you want me to expose who Spressy is? Cause I'll do it. I'll do it. I'm not a coward. I've I've done worse. Look at this. Looting! You can loot the containers in this in this town. And oh boy, oh boy, it's so much fun. You guys wouldn't believe how fun this is. Just you get to hop around on this on this beautiful island and open up cabinets. Cabinet gameplay, finally. Spressy sounds sussy. Listen, <laughs> if you put an ussy on the end of anything, it'll probably make it'll probably make your day better. Here we go. We got a note. No reading. No reading. Can I turn off the voice acting? It's awful in this game. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just not good. It's just bad. They should have got me to do some of these voices. Okay. Listen, I've got a prof I've got a professional mic. I've got a pop filter. I've got. Absorbent amounts of free time. Just hire me to do it. I'll do it for five bucks. Okay, that's my promise. I'll do any. I'll do any voice work that y'all want for five bucks. You want nuggets right now? Don't you know that you can't survive on chicken nuggets alone? Eat some dang vegetables. I thought you did voices for this game. I only did. I only did one voice line. I didn't want to. I didn't want to count it. Didn't want to count. I only did one specific voice line, and I'm not playing it again because I'm far too embarrassed. Far too embarrassed. I don't feel like a real voice actor yet, so just give me some, give me some time, you guys. You gotta figure out your audio, but I probably won't. Wait, what? Don't nair it off. Six hour time waster. Yeah, and like, I think that it was a pretty cheap, it was a pretty cheap hair job though. I think that they did it for an affordable price. I gave them a I gave them a nice tip, even though I was scared that they burned off all my hair. But you know what? Fear never determined the tip. Now did it? What I care about is results. Darn it! Results! Here we go. We got bees on this island. Oh boy! Oh boy! Bees be buzzing. Oh wait! 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 There's special stuff to do in here. There's special stuff on this island, you guys. There's important, oi, important oi, things. Oi. That... Not Sprussy tipped twenty dollars. <laughs> Not Sprussy. Some pizza. The good stuff. Stop! No more Sprussy. No Sprussy. That's horrible. Y'all are gonna get me banned. Thank you, not Spressy. It's Lady Pink Monster. What's up, Monster? Monster. You guys, can we please get some hype in the chat for freaking not Spressy? For not Spressy and Monster? Oh my gosh, Monster with the resub, not Spressy with the mega pizza money. The mega pizza money. Do you want it? 
Do, do I want to know what Spressy is? No. And I need to stop saying it or I'm going to get banned. Listen, I've somehow avoided the 18 plus filter for a while now. No, don't, don't ruin this for me. This is my moment. This is my stream. <laughs> Thank you so much for the pizza money. You didn't have to do that. I already said I can take care of myself. I've been doing it for years. There we go. You guys, it's best, it's best, best avoided. Best never said again. Oh, there we go. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Waterworks, water production. Do you see what I'm doing here, you guys? This is, uh, this is a high grade puzzle. Not for the faint of heart. Look at that. Water comes down here, and then you gotta rotate it this way and get it into that next. Uh, this is the stupidest puzzle in the game. This. <laughs> This is this is why this game's so janky because it's got puzzles like this. <laughs> stop giving him money. What? Listen, listen. I just said stop saying that word. I don't care if it's attached to money. I don't care if you're saying it for free. Don't, <laughs> don't give me banned. Don't give me banned. <laughs> Let's go. Spressy is now considered one of the top ten most offensive words in Australia. And half of my audience is in Australia. We're in big trouble. Whoa! What the heck? Oh, there's birds on this island. I forgot about that. Did you see me just get attacked by that bird? It throwed a rock at me. Okay. Uh, I'm just blasting water. Hang on. Big brain water blaster. Fill up. Fill up, you stupid. You stupid old duck. Wait a minute. I can almost reach it. Ah, more water necessary. Release the river. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> That's the first time that I heard it. <laughs> I love that sound effect. I've been practicing that sound for a long time. Ooh. Oh, here it comes. It's dropping rocks on my head. Ah, you fool. Oh, hey, Ashley Rose. Thank you for the 10 bitties. Thank you for the gnome, too. How are you doing, Ashley? Tonight's a short stream. Short new hair stream, unstyled, unstyled hair stream. Absolutely, totally janky, totally whack hair. I'd rate it 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, would ratio again. Burb was just trying to share, exactly. He's trying to drop the pizza in my lap. That rock is actually, it's actually a rock pizza. Delivered straight from Papa John's. Thanks Papa John's, always here on time. Never, never waste my money. Good old Papa John's. I don't trust anyone else. I wouldn't trust anybody but Papa. Hello? Is this not a... Oh my God. Oh my God, please. Give me the thing. Give me the... How much do I have to fill this up? You guys, this game was made by a 10 year old. He made it out of crayons, paper mache. Actually, that's that's talking too bad about crayons and paper mache. I've seen some really beautiful art made by both of those things. Okay, this is made by a child with mud. This is programmed on a mud computer using mud technology. Oh my god! Look, is there like a wasted water mechanic? Give it a couple more pumps. I gave it two more pumps. There we go. We finally got one zipline part. Okay, so this is this is the island where you get the zipline, you guys. This is the this is where the game starts getting real. M U D D D. What does that stand for? What is that? What does that say? You can't just you can't just type things like that in the chat without explaining. Calico. That could mean anything. Don't let marine. T <laughs> Don't let marine hear you talk bad about crayons. That's why. I, that's why I went back. I went back on it. I would never. Ashley Rose, I, I would never insult crayons. People have made beautiful things with crayons. But mud? Have you ever seen beautiful mud art? I don't think so. I've seen beautiful sand art. There's a steam sale? Okay, we're gonna go shopping later, you guys. You're gonna go shopping? I have $15 in my steam wallet. We can buy anything. We can buy anything. You know what? I'm gonna give y'all an allowance of fifteen dollars, and y'all can y'all can get anything that you want from the Steam sale. Oh, oh, a little chicken, <laughs> a little weird chicken. Who who is this dubious little dubious little devil? You think I'm gonna hurt him? Y'all must think I'm a I'm, I'm a mean person. I would never. That's a good little chicken. I ain't touching him. 
wholesome, the most wholesome of them all. You have fun. Good night, Anne. Go to bed. Go to bed, Anne. Things are popping in. I love your spork art. I love your spork art. I'm sorry that I didn't reply to you. Today was crazy. Today was crazy. Also, Furlio. Hey! Furlio! You like the hair? <laughs> It's, it's styling's a little weird. I feel like it'd be cool to like split it down the middle, leave some bangs, and then put it in a in a little uh, ponytail. That's what I'm thinking. I think that'll be the final design, final boss. Final boss is gonna be me with my character dying. Oh no, I need water. What are we gonna do now? What are we gonna do now when we have no water? Oh my God. Very Draco, Dra Draco Malfoy's freshman year at college. Oh, pink monster, you don't even know. You don't even know. Whenever it was getting bleached and it was still yellow, he had it all slicked back and I looked exactly like Draco. It looked exactly the same. I would have told him, but he, I wouldn't have gotten the reference, I don't think. You hate Texas summers? Oh my gosh, so freaking hot. Besides, Draco had his hair like all the way back, right? Didn't he have it slicked back? Slick back. Wait, 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 wait. Fill with fresh water. Delicious. Hey, Miss Obi, what's up? What do you mean you found me again? Did I go missing? Did I go missing and not even know? Pray to the, wait, what the heck just hit me? Oh, it's the bird. Did the bird follow me? No? Wait, what the heck? How'd I get hit by something? Were we, were we so deep in the what? Okay. My father will hear about this? Your what? Oh. <laughs> oh, Draco says that. My father will hear about this. Harry Potter, you'll suffer. My father's going to buy us Nimbus 3000s. And then Mrs. McGonagall will as well. It'll be all even Steven, but just between us. Ah! Stop attacking me, you stupid bird. Oh my gosh, this bird doesn't know who I am. This bird doesn't know what we're doing here. Doesn't know how serious it is. Wait, where'd he go? Is the bird getting rocks from the middle of the ocean? Okay, what? Well, oh, here he comes. Oh lord. Oh lordy. Okay, so you have to have, oh my god. He can beam me. Oh my gosh, just look at it. What a piece of, what a, what a bird. I, that is so angering. That is so angering. Stop! I'm sorry. It just got me upset. I was just upset about the bird. He's just... Okay, I guess I'm gonna hide in here. Guess we gotta make a... Uh... We're gonna make a bow. We gotta kill him. Listen, I said I'd never hurt nature, but... For this, we make an exception. Oops! No, 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 no. Put that anchor back down. <laughs> oh. There you go. Yeah, we gotta turn him into a fried chicken. I'm sorry. Listen, you guys, I would, I, I would never, would never advocate violence against birds unless it was 100% necessary. Okay, we got a metal arrow, stone. Have I been making? I can only make stone arrows. <laughs> Moi. <laughs> Moi! <laughs> oh shoot! <laughs> ah. Ah. That's so funny. Moi's checking Steam and got scared by me screaming. <laughs> That's the funniest stuff I've heard all day. <laughs> we gotta kill that bird. He's the one. He's the one that we have to blame for this. He's the one that caused the faux pas. Where is he? Where's the, as soon as I can kill him, he just leaves. Oh, here he comes. Oh, I hit him, I hit him. That's a direct hit. That's a direct hit. That's you watching Aladdin? What? Oh, are you talking about, what? You don't like the bird in Aladdin? Wait a minute. Are you talking about Iago? Iago the bird king? I wish that Iago was the true oh. prince. I wish that he won in the end. All right, that's two hits. Two hits on Birdo. All right, Buster, come on, do it again. Do it again. 
What was your reaction when Ops left Sasha? I knew it was gonna happen. Listen, Ops is far too lucky, runs into the best villagers and says, no, I think I'm gonna go for the clown. This is all too typical. This is all very expected. So all I did was just knowingly look at the screen, gently shake my head. It's just, listen, now that, now that I've been dating Ops long enough, this kind of stuff is just, just an everyday occurrence. It's, it's very upsetting, but you know, what can you do? You, you just can't, you just can't help people do what they should do. Like, take Sasha, the best villager in the entire game. You just can't help some people, all right? I learned, I learned that you can't change those that you're in a relationship with, so I, I gave up on Ops long ago. But, but he did go for the best, for the, for the best alternative, though. The me cat. The cat that looks like me. He's got the droopy eyes. He's got the dubious expression. Honestly, I think he's the embodiment of Earl. Uh, you said, what? The live action Aladdin? Uh, listen, I tried to watch the live action Aladdin and uh, I gave up. I gave up. I couldn't, I couldn't finish it. The only thing that haunts me about the Disney, the Disney uh, remakes is just, I always, if I start watching them, I'm just like, why am I not watching the original one? Like they're not even that bad. They're not even that bad content wise. I just, I just don't, I, I just don't get why I would watch a lower quality version of it. Golly, why is there water on the screen? What are, is, am I getting drops in my eyeballs? That doesn't even make any physical sense. I don't have any glass on my face. What's going on? There's one genie in Aladdin. <laughs> I mean, I actually, I actually from, from the clips that I've seen, I kind of like Will Smith's genie a little bit. I don't know if that's considered sacrilege, but I mean, it's different. Sure, it's different, but I'm glad that he didn't do too much of like uh, an impression of of Robin Williams or anything. I, I felt like it was a pretty, it was a relatively fine performance from what I saw. He just Will Smithed it up, you know? He just Will Smithed it up. There's two genies though, yeah. It's true, Will Smith breaks into like a, uh, I'm not Will Smith, the Robin Williams one, he breaks into like a million genies. There's many multiple genies. Jafar, Jaclose. <gasps> Miss Obi, thank you, I got the hair did today, so I didn't have any time to style it. I didn't have any time to style it, this is just, this is how I woke up. This is how I woke up in the chair after six hours of hair doing. I see the birds behind me. We're gonna, we're gonna murk that bird. This bird's going down. He mocks me for the last time. Wait, where'd he go? I can't use these zipline ropes because I don't have all the parts yet. One of the parts is at the bottom of the ocean, but I can't, I can't swim and get it right now because I won't be able to see Jack Baloney right now. So, no! Oh! Could you? Oh my gosh, I just wasted an arrow. I just wasted one of my precious stuff. Okay, this time we got him. Jafar, Jaclose, ja everywhere at once. All right, long shot. Bam. Big hit. Giant hit. There's only one bird. Like, he can respawn, but he, only he doesn't respawn on the island again. I don't think. He better not, or I'm gonna be a big upsetty. There we go. And he's dead. That's kind of sad. I didn't like the way that he just turned into a rag doll and just flopped down. He couldn't defend himself. He was just dropping rocks because that was his nature. You guys, I'm starting to have second, second thoughts about this bird. I don't think he had any malicious intent. He had delicious intent because he was going to eat us. He's gonna, he was just hunting. He was just following his programming. His genetic programming. We should have brought the net this second time. I need to get all these bees. We'll get all these bees and then we'll make our own bee farm. I'll just grab the honeycombs. What's up, Gene Fruits? Too late for second thoughts, only regrets. <laughs> well, also, we need a, well, we got, listen, if we're gonna kill a bird, we gotta make sure that we take full advantage. We gotta make sure that we loot that corpse. It's the only way. Where, where does body fall? Where'd the, where'd the body of the defenseless bird fall? Should be around here somewhere, right? Where, where's the corpse? Where's the corpse? Where's the corpse husband? Wait, get out of here. 
I don't want to hear your talk. Wait a minute. Yeah, I thought it was over. I thought it was in here. Where did the, where did the bird fall? Does his, bo does his body float? Oh my god, I'm gonna die again! Why don't I remember that this is a survival game? Why, why do I keep forgetting? You guys, my brain can hold like one single variable at a time. Oh, there he is. Le corpse. We got... <laughs> we got a bunch of feathers and a screecher head hat. What's up? What's the button for it? The <laughs> There's a button for third person. <laughs> Here we go. Looking good. <laughs> Is this a hat? This is more like a little ball cap, and it doesn't. Wear How's it attached? <laughs> there should be a little string around my neck. What? <laughs> what is up with his hat? I don't like it. It doesn't. It just looks like it's pasted on my head. Just pasted. We should we should uh, collect a bunch of hats. Collect hats from everything. All the hats. All right. Now it's just distracting. Get out of here. We got biofuel. I didn't even know that. It's attached by magic. Is magic in this game? Whoa. I'm learning. You just stuck its unplucked skull on your head. Did you even empty it first? No. The brain is the glue. Listen, I don't want. I don't want to get too graphic with you guys. T.W. T.W. Discussion of gore. The brain is surprisingly, um... Sticky? I don't know. Uh, wait. Somebody said Sasha a while ago, and that reminds me of one of my favorite shows. One of your favorite shows? What? It has a Sasha in it? Listen, there's only one Sasha that I care about. And that's Sasha Baron Cohen, or whatever his name is. And also the villager in Minecraft. Grab this. Okay, we gotta feed ourselves. We're gonna die. Deep fried brain? Oh boy. Now we're watching the full collection of Indiana Jones. All three of them. All three of the Indiana Jones movies. Of course there's magic, considering it takes honey to make biofuel in this game. What? Listen, that's real. That's how that's how real biofuel works. You need to you need to study up. You need to study up on fuel development. Come here. Corn corn makes gas, you know? Alright. Fix that, because he just chomped my ship. I should have known. I should have known that he'd be up to those kind of shenanigans. We're gonna cook his drumsticks. Cooking his drumsticks and, and jerky. Mmm, yum. Yum. Carnivore diet. Carnivore diet. Mmm, very healthy. Very healthy. It gives me all my vital nutrients. Everything that you need is in meat, you guys. Did you know that? It's it's me, the Earl with his incredible life tips and hacks. You guys, I'll explain the world to you. Step by step. Wait. We need another we need another uh You can't believe that Oopsie found Sasha? I'm honestly surprised that he found Sasha that's that quickly. Like he did does anybody know how many how many tickets he went through? Cause it didn't seem like it was that many. Cause he only ran into like one cat, I thought. I didn't watch the whole VOD. Somebody did. Somebody watched it. Ooh, cooked chicken. Cooked chicken. Hey, Kato, what's up? Oi! You like the hair? You like the hair? Oi, 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 oi! Kato, the beard's, the beard's going tonight. Okay, after the stream, I'm shaving the beard off, but I'm loving the hair. The hair took forever. It took forever. I, I, almost, I almost fell asleep while they were doing it was very close to passing out. He bleached it three times. Okay, here we go. Is that, the, is that the second time that he found Sasha while searching for a villager? Please don't tell me that. Please don't tell me that he ignored the best villager in the game twice. I, I, I don't believe it. Are you playing the new Raft update? I mean, listen, the all-knowing cheese, of course I am. I'm always on the cutting edge of gaming. I, I would never, I would never stoop so low to play an outdated version of literally the most groundbreaking game of this millennia. Oh, you know, you know that it's, that it is the latest update. It's got, it's got new islands. It's got a ice biome. It's got new fish. It's got other stuff in it that I didn't read about. Now listen, I'm going to be honest. I just booted up this game. I've never even played it before. 
No, I love the beard, Mr. Burnham. Okay, that seals the deal. It's gotta go. It's gotta go. Um, I was there for the whole stream, but I can't remember how he used. Maybe like 60? See, that's... <laughs> Whenever he said that he was only gonna look for cats, I was like, bruh, you know what's gonna happen. You know that Ops is, is gonna find one super fast. Should have gone for the big haul. The big haul. 800 tickets is what I did last time. 800 tickets. Not actually suggested. Please don't do that. Please don't use all 800 of your tickets. Okay, we are almost ready to traverse this island. All I have to do is merely remember how everything works on this island. Also, I just had a big idea. Big idea productions. What we need to do first is do the potato swap method. We put the seaweed right here. Now we go over here and we make a water bottle. That's right, another water bottle. As soon as we have enough goo. And then I can make the illustrious, the fantastic, the amazing. Oh my gosh, I can't make it. I can't make it. It's impossible. We have to research. I was gonna make um I was gonna make an air tank, but it would take two bottles to do that. That's that's so much. Haka! What's up? My hair is very strange. <laughs> I love it! I love the new hair. Oi, oi! Haka update. New Earl just dropped. New Earl just dropped. Do you know what? He's gonna bring friends. I'm, I gotta put the hat away. No bird hat. No bird hat. Oh, actually, we need the bow and the arrow for the puffer fish. Spoiler alert. Whoops. Spoiler alert. There are puffer fish in this game. They get up to no good. Alright, fill us up with fresh water. Here we go. Delicious. Oh, delicious. You're so close to finishing the presents for my friends for our graduation. Oh, awkward. Are you making are you making art? You making friendly art? Art for friends? Friends and arts? But bird hat is so stylish. It's true. But have you seen shark hat? Have you seen shark hat? Because once you go shark, you never go bark. <gasps> One smack! One smack! Oh yeah, and Akimek, I saw you notice the uh, the the fact that it's a signpost. <laughs> yeah, it's a street sign, and it looks like it says "Oste Oste." That's the only thing that I can read. I, I don't know what else it says. Okay, okay, we got the water, we got the food, we got the goo cooking. Oh wait, this goo goes fast. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. If that goes so fast, then I might be able to make the water bottles. The forbidden bottle. Oh my gosh. He's blowing everybody's minds with his bottle research. Listen, you guys, don't bottle up your emotions. Instead, bottle up all your fresh water that you just made. Okay, we need one empty bottle and a bunch of... Oh my gosh, you need, you need vine goo and water bottles? This is insanity! I like how you magically make a cardboard box without... <laughs> <laughs> you make a cardboard box when throwing out items? Listen, what you don't understand is that on my back, it's invisible. On my back, I'm carrying a large stack of cardboard boxes, exactly like the popular game, uh, uh, Death Stranding. It's a Death Stranding mechanic. You can't see them, but they're there, all right? You just have to, you just have to believe in the developers. Believe in someone else for once. You believed in yourself all of your life. Now it's time to believe in someone else. And that someone else is me. I gotta fix the boat before it falls apart. The stupid shark has taken taken nips out of my uh out of my beautiful boat. My beautiful boat that I've slaved over. Oh yeah, Death Stranding. I have Death Stranding. But I don't know if I, I we're definitely not gonna play that. That is not a stream game. The game that we're playing right now isn't even a stream game. You guys, let's be honest. This is this is a chill simulator. This is nothing but a snooze simulator. The only thing that you can do in this game is that you can either play with friends, do a hardcore challenge run, or you can just float around on a boat and talk about your hair. Guess which path I'm going on right now. Oh wait, these things weren't even running. Shaking my head, dude. You guys won't believe whenever the next arc of my stream starts. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be unreal. It's gonna be unreal. You will not believe 
what's coming up. Hello? Give me the goo. Okay, there we go. The goo has been got. And can I get... Can I get a bottle? No. We cannot make a... Yes, we can. We can do it. We have the technology. We finally acquired the materials necessary. The giant brain. Big brain, empty bottle. Empty brain, giant bottle. There we go, we only need rope. We need four ropes. We got one. One rope, one dream. One man, one mission, one rope. Hello? Can you make the ropes while they're in the... Yes, you can. Yes, you can. We're draining our, our palm tree supply. <laughs> Is this when you're going to become a COD-only streamer? Into the Tarkov PUBG era? Finally entering the shooters? Becoming a shooter streamer? Listen, there's only a few paths that you can go. You can either go full crowd engagement, you can go shooter, or you can go retro. Those are the only options, you guys. There's no other way. There's no other way to be an elite streamer. Those are the three three options. Texan bread! Enjoy watching um, Amphibia. Amphibia, your favorite show? Oh my gosh. The best show in the world? Uh, enjoy. I have a tip. If you're gonna use reinforced platforms, just use them on the side. Oh yes, absolutely. I saw somewhere that you can actually reinforce these things too, the nets. It's genius. Sims, that's that's not a method. That's not a method to be a big streamer. Listen, if you're gonna if you're gonna do uh if you're gonna do Sims, you gotta you gotta have a YouTube channel. You gotta you have a YouTube channel. Also you have to be cute and have a good background, okay? Listen, I'm not I'm not ready to I'm not ready to put that much commitment in. I I just remove that option because it's not an option for me, okay? Same thing with Stardew Valley, like you have to have, you have to be good at talking to people and be engaging and stuff, okay? I can't do that. I can't do that. If you want to go the Animal Crossing route, I haven't, I mean, like, Opsty's, Opsty's doing well with Animal Crossing, but listen, Opst has a personality. I don't. It won't work. <laughs> you stupid old, oh, never mind. All is forgiven. All is forgiven. Oh dear shark, thank you for the- oh wait! Hat. We have acquired shark paraphernalia. Ta-da! <laughs> this is not a hat. Mugbangs! Ew! No! No, we're not doing eating streams. Those are so yucky. Yucky, yucky. I do not like eating ASMR. Not even a little bit. It's disgusting. Get, 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 get. Mmm, water. Well, uh, I like this, uh, I like this walk that it has. A little human? The Pringle Can Mayonnaise Powdered Microwave Computer. What? <laughs> you can't just string words together like that, the all-knowing cheese, and expect it to mean something. That, uh, you can... <laughs> You're not just allowed to pick things from the dictionary and put them together. That doesn't that doesn't mean anything. All right here we go. Oh, my shark meat, shark meat. Hoo ha ha! Cook it, cook it. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna put that there. We got the cooked potato. We got the water. We maybe need more water. We need more water. We're starving for water, friends. Make sure that you drink your, drink your juice. Drink your juice, rehydrate. Is everybody in the chat hydrating? I'm not kidding, kidding. The battery is a tub of mayonnaise. What, are you talking about the battery up here? That's not a tub of mayonnaise, that's a tub of margarine. Yeah, this is, this is clearly margarine. Uh, it does, it does actually say mayonnaise on it. I, um. Did not, I, I thought that you were, well, listen, facts have never gotten in my way before. There we go. We got it. We got it going. We got it going. Now, what are we going to do? Um, is there a bear head? There is indeed. I, I killed a bunch of bears, but I didn't pick it up. ASMR and I'll be out faster than sound. Wait, all ASMR? You guys, is every, is everybody against all ASMR in the chat? 
Do I stand alone? Do I stand alone as an elite ASMR enjoyer? I just don't like eating sounds. Eating sounds big yucky. Seven new games? Did you just buy seven games, Calico? Calico, did you just purchase seven new games whenever you haven't even finished all the ones that you have? You haven't even finished Spelunky. Tell me when you're gonna finish Spelunky. I bet you I've not beat Amalek yet. Buying new games before you finish them. I guess that I guess that makes you a real gamer now. Good job, you made it. Okay, we're gonna fill this up with fresh water and then top off the other one and we're ready to explore this dang old island. We got our got our water tank. Let's see, we're gonna put our bow right here. Can we get rid of anything else? We'll catch all the bugs, we'll dig all the dirt. Um I guess not not all this stuff is necessary. Let's let's throw out the hammer. We don't need it. A hammer goes there. Cup, don't need it. Alright, let's go. Is that I haven't gotten past the first level of the jungle yet? Tell me when you played Spelunky 2. What? Spelunky 2? I'm never playing that again. What are you talking about? The only hard game that I'm ever gonna play anymore is getting over it. Alright. Now, let's see. I think I need a I think I need a slither through here. Oh yeah, awkward. You got a you got a PS4. You bought a PS4 in 2022. How do you feel? How do you feel? Tell us your story. Tell us your story. Anybody buy a, a PS4 this year? You just bought it, it's half off. Spelunky 2? Spelunky 2 is even harder. Why'd you get a harder game? You'll never even finish the first one. Allie, you don't realize how difficult Spelunky 2 is. I don't even understand it. And I'm a pro gamer. I get paid for gaming. Okay, we gotta kill at least one puffer fish. Because they give you exploding powder. Not sure how many stone arrows it takes. Oh, is he dead? Oh, oh, oh. He dead. Alright, I was confused for a second. What'd you say? I might finish it. I, I don't think you can do it, Callie. I'm setting this as a challenge for you right now. I don't I don't think that you can beat it. I don't think you can beat Spelunky. Ah, uh, here we go. Back down we go. Get swimming. Get swimming. Everybody get on your floaties. Get on your water wings. Ignore the exploding fish. They can't hurt us now. Did they change the map? This feels different. Alright, we are in danger. We are now deep underwater. You're getting the zip lines? Yes. You you have to get the zip lines to finish this island. It's, it's a non-optional. Oh, this is this is just a checkpoint. We gotta keep going. Deeper. Deeper. Deep and wide. Deep and wide. There's an ocean flowing deep and wide. All right, this is it. The crate at the bottom. I feel like I can't get a PS5, so I wanted to play Spidey Boy and also treat myself. I mean, valid. Valid. Enjoy. I mean, there's lots of good games on the PS4. There's lots of good games. You got the huge backlog. I mean, I bought the PS3 super late in its lifetime and I got to just play everything that came out for it. I think we can make it all the way to the top without taking a breath. There we go. Rosera, we'll see you later. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Have a good time. We'll be back tomorrow at normal times and we won't be playing Raft. Okay, you guys, so soak it in. Soak in all the summer vibes. Summer vibes. All right, towards the surface. The surface is coming. We're gonna make it. I can feel it. You can swim all the way from the b -b -b bottom. <laughs> is it a hard game if you finished it 50 times? What? What do you mean? Just because it isn't hard for me doesn't mean that it isn't a hard game, Alchemic, you silly. You silly Billy. Listen, I'm not the, I'm not the sole gamer in this world. If people have problems with the game and are, and are bad at it, then good, I can flex on them. Also, wait, what the heck? What? 
what? <laughs> this is like a little swim cap. No, Who's, who allowed this? Who allowed this to happen? Who okayed this? Who put this on the Trello board? Oh my gosh. Should we blame the fans or the developers on this? We've got a, we've got a fish hat. Oh my goodness. Well, at the very least, it doesn't inhibit your vision. I guess that's an improvement, right? Hey, Via, what's up? New hair. New hair, new me. New me, do me. Brand new Earl just dropped. 2.0 DLC add-on hair mod hair mod no styling included you gotta customize the style yourself oi VO how are you doing welcome to the island welcome to the island that we're living on hello you're you're welcome to live on this island I'm the mayor here I call all the shots I call all the shots and I kill all the birds and also what is there nothing on this Why'd I walk all the way over here? Oh, I think that this is where the rocket lands, you guys. It's where the rocket lands. Spoiler alert. Listen, the first thing that we gotta do is take this explosive powder that we've gotten and we have to go dry it out. Let me go dry it out. Then you guys will see what is up. How am I gonna style it? Listen, Calico, do you think I have a magic... Do you think I have a magic ball? Just because I have wizard hair now, just because I've been dubbed Kenny the White, does not mean that I've been given my, uh, my orb. I've not been given my orb of... of seeing. My all-seeing orb. Not yet. I don't know. I'll have to... I'll have to try out stuff. I gotta try out all the hair styling stuff that I picked up. Oh my goodness. Got so much, so much garbage to put in my hair. Oh, wait. Whack! Now that, now that is a good whack right there. There we go, we have the drying explosive powder. It's almost ready. Is this munch a crunch on this shark meat? Hello? Are you cooking? Why are you taking so long? Oh, it's cooking, all right. All right, well, the game's not broken. Okay, here we go. We only got four potatoes left. Hey, Taka! Thank you for the raid! What's up? Hey! It's the Lion Den! Oh my gosh. Daniel just barely got out of there. Oi! It's me, Ducky! Nice to meet you! Hello! Taka! Hi! Hello there. Is that... Is that Snickers? Oi, oi! Welcome in! Welcome in! Thank you! Thank you so much, Lion Den. Hello, nice to meet y'all. My name's Earl. French Pepe the Frog. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We got French frogs in the chat, you guys. French fried frog legs. Hey, hi! I remember you talking about the new hair stream. It's here! <laughs> He's in the purple void. I didn't I didn't set up a background, okay? Oi oi! Jackson was watching both. You know what? If you're if you're friends of if you're friends of Tonka and Earl. That means that you're probably a perfect, probably a perfect person, okay? French Pepe the Frog, what legs, bro? French fried frog legs at Doc Hoppers? Never heard of this? You haven't been informed of, of what Doc Hopper is doing to your frogly kind? Listen, I don't want to be the bearer of bad news, but... I'm just saying. Sorry that you had to hear it like this. But they're, but they're frying those legs. The shirt is 10 out of 10. Oh, the shirt that I'm wearing? <laughs> it says a gift from Alchemic Refuge. <laughs> In case you're wondering. <laughs> Listen, I wasn't gonna shout out, I'm not gonna shout out all of the style that you give me, because you give me so much. But you know, if, if you're gonna mention it, I'll mention it. <laughs> I mean, I found you both through Salty, who you found for, through OT. Who you found by going through Clicky? Oh my gosh, Jackson. That's the pipeline. That's the that's the pipeline to the LGBTQ plus community. <laughs> it's the pipeline. <laughs> Here we go. It is a nice shirt. I love the uh I, I really like relaxed Hawaiian shirts too. Collared shirts are already nice, but then this one's really swaffed. This one's really swaffed. Also, thank you for the follow, Snickers. I hope you're doing good. <laughs> 
You like the shirt, to be honest? So do I. So do I. You know, the only thing that's making me kind of weirded out by this hair is that it matches my skin tone, like, a lot. Like, I just look like uh, I'm a light bulb. I, just, I look like I'm Edna, except for the sun has been shining on her forever. Uh, okay, we're now ready. We're now ready to re-enter the island. We have the explosive powder. French Pepe! Oh my gosh, I can't, I can't believe that you followed after what I said. After what I said, I thought I'd be canceled by all the frogs. You know what? Good music always pulls through. Thank you, thank you for the follow. <laughs> What's up? Welcome, welcome to the madness. Hi, my name's Earl. I play a variety of games. A variety of games. I am an aimless human being that is walking this earth with no sense of purpose and no feelings of belonging. I have no goals. I have uh, ugh, hardly any personality. And I'm 25 years old and I don't even have a high school degree. Here we go. <laughs> Spend all my money on hair, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> okay. I wish that I could catch this little chicken with my net. He got away. He got away. Don't trust that chicken. He's on the run. That chicken's got a knife. Put on your body armor. We're going against some really tough chickens. There we go. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> I got Brad to start making that sound and he didn't know what it meant. I was like, it's a cow sound. And he just kept going, ah. Oh. And I was like, maybe you should stop doing that. <laughs> I, don't want you to, I don't want you to get in trouble later. Blame me for it. Ah, oh. bees. All right. Uh, so did you wash it first or nah? What are you talking about? Did I wash what first? Thank you for the follow, it's me, Ducky. Came in with the Taka raid. Also, Taka, make sure that you get food and water if you need to. Oi, oi! Taka, thank you again for bringing your friends over here. Thank you. Wahoo! What, did I wash the hair before I got it bleached three times? No, I did not. I, it hadn't been washed for like three days. I know, I know that you're supposed to keep like a bunch of natural oil on it so that it doesn't, it doesn't get like destructoid. No, it was, it was nice and healthy. It was nice and healthy and, and he said that my hair was very nice and that it was really well taken care of. My scalp was a little janky. Scalp was a little, was a little irritated, but he said that the hair was great and like almost none of it fell out. Also, holy crap, that guy burnt so bad! It reminded me of my first... At first, I only have one. It reminded me of my tattoo. It hurt so much. I almost was gritting my teeth. It was so painful. He, he bleached my hair three times and then just slathered that dye on. Oh! I was on, my head was on fire. It's the Mario Kart 8 lick. You should name the chicken Hey Hey. Yeah, I think that it's spelled. I'm trying to remember. Is it H E I? I think. Hey Hey, are you talking about the one from uh, from Moana? Yeah. Hey Hey, the little chicken. It does look like Hey Hey. That's a good point. You love bleaching hair, though. It burns so good. Burns so good. What's wrong with you? Alchemic. I didn't know this about you. You you. Pain gives you pleasure? Is that true? Is that true? Alchemic, I... I don't know what to say. Don't, don't know what to say whenever you tell me that you like bleaching your hair and it hurts. I don't know. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna go up this way. Swag! New hair! Hey! What's up? <laughs> Mythical! <laughs> Mythical! How are you doing? Oh my god. I hope you are feeling well. Oi, 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 oi. New hair, new hair. I got it done today, so I did not style it. This is how it just, this is, I, I, this is how, how we stopped making it. And <laughs> I figured out that it looks exactly like the character from Nier, from Nier, what is it called? Automata? 
I look like I look like 2B. I'm gonna shave off my beard and I'm gonna get a blindfold. And we'll play near tomorrow. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Stay tuned. Stay tuned for more. I think that game's too hard. There we go. Get out of here. Mythical's up to shenanigans, no doubt. No doubt. The Mario Lick. Yeah. Have you seen that video of the of the student? The student that sneaks the Mario Lick into the music? Kenny's an anime protagonist. Yeah. Oi, oi, oi. Finally, the Kenny anime is being released. If if the Kenny anime was a genre, what would it be? What would it be? Would it be shonen? Would it be comedy? Slice of life, sports, uh, horror. Here we go, here we go. Isekai. <laughs> Isekai. Wait, did, did I get Isekai'd into this world or am I going to another one? Am I, am I just Isekai'ing into this world? I just die in this world and then I get brought back as a slime in the normal world. I got brought back as a slime into the normal world. You grew with Brulio? How? How is it an isekai? Do I at least get a harem of cute boys and girls? Here we go. Are you talking about home bleach or salon bleach? Wait, what? what are you talking about? Well, this is getting too complicated. Bleaching hair feels like scratching your scalp with fire. I, it hurt a lot. The first one didn't hurt. The second one hurt a lot more. And then the third one hurt the most. And then the dye hurt. Shenanigans, me never. <laughs> I I highly doubt that mythical. I I don't think that you. I don't think that you can exist without shenanigans just floating around you. Like a little solar system around your around your forehead. A bunch of little tiny madness planets, affecting your every thought, controlling every whim. Um. Serious question. I didn't really know that I burned what what that it burned, does it really? Um, yes. It uh because the bleach so the, well that's why the first bleach didn't hurt, because he bleached my tips first. He bleached my tip, and then he then he bleached my scalp the second time. Uh, he bleached like all the hair the second time, and then bleached all the hair again, and yes, it does it does irritate and hurt your and hurt your scalp. No jokes. No jokes, no goofs. Scalp bleaching. Yeah, because I mean it does you can't you can't feel anything in your hair. Your hair doesn't have any nerves. Your hair is nerveless. Listen, if your hair was your brain, then you'd never get nervous speaking in public. Okay? I need to jump into the water without dying. I can barely see. It is so dark. We must improve the gamut in this game, but I, I'm not a developer. Ah, bleach is a chemical reaction. It, oh, yeah, it causes heat, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's very warm. It's very warm. It's like a warm hug or a big glass of vodka. Also, I looked up. I was, I was Googling while I was waiting. I was looking up what drinks do gay people drink. And uh, apparently, vodka consumption is way higher among the uh, LGBTQ plus than uh, than with the straights. That's just what I that's just what I read. You got <laughs> guys, you guys, this game. Oh my gosh! And beer drinking is way more common among the straights. It's just facts, you guys. I'm just reading y'all the the law. Ah. Here we go. Damn, that damn absolute vodka goodness. I'm the only vodka that I've, well, I guess I've tried Tito's. <laughs> but this is my favorite. This is my favorite. Look at this skull in a boat. Skull in a boat. Ah! Here we go. The crystal skull in a boat. This is my new, uh, this is my new PNG tuber. It'll just be the skull. The skull? It also looks so fancy in the lights. We gotta go up here. 
I'm straight and I mix vodka with lot. No, it's like four. Well, uh, it's like 40% versus. No, it's like 30% versus 50%. But yes, you should be worried for unrelated reasons. Uh, wait, is that the Dan Aykroyd one? It is. Have you seen the JonTron video about it? <laughs> Mythical, did you see that? Did you see the JonTron video about it? Dan Aykroyd is crazy. Dan Aykroyd is gone. <laughs> that man. I thought that Ghostbusters was just a joke. <laughs> I thought it was a joke. But he was serious the whole time. He thought he was actually hunting ghosts and they were making a documentary. Bill Murray was like, Dan, you don't actually believe this. And Dan's like, oh no, I'm serious. <laughs> Dan was like, the crystal skulls. That's what, that's where I'll make my money. Have you ever felt less haunted? Have you ever felt less haunted since buying the vodka? To be honest, all the, all of the demonic visits have kind of petered off a little bit. I was having, uh, I was having night terrors. Uh, you know, sleep paralysis demons dancing on my corpse, dabbing in my general direction. And now, you know what? Everything's changed. Ever since I got Dan Aykroyd's triple distilled, diamond filtered, crystal skull, 100% accurate human representation of the skull vodka. <clears throat> Not sponsored. Although, if I could get a free bottle, that'd be great because they're kind of expensive. Um, to be honest, the pain doesn't bother me enough to stop bleaching. Oh no. Oh no, it's not enough to stop you. If you're thinking about not bleaching your hair, don't. Don't not, don't not do it. Don't, don't, don't not bleach your hair because of the pain, okay? You can endure it. Listen, you're strong. I know you're strong. I've known you for so long. I've known you for so long and I've seen you endure so much more. You can handle the bleach pain, okay? I believe in you. Now perish. I'm speaking to the shark. Diamond filtered? Yes, it's a diamond. It's, it's filtered through high quality Herkimer diamonds. <laughs> Isn't that right? The Herkimer, Herkimer diamonds. Why do I remember so much about this video? It's probably because I watched it three times. Is it getting a tattoo feels nice? Moy, I think that we've already established that your pain tolerance is broken. I think that we already established that there is there's something going on in that body of yours. But um, it, it's not that bad, okay? Tattoos are not that bad. You've had the same hairstyle since you were like six? Now listen, if it works, it works, Mythical. There's absolutely no reason to change. Okay. It's all a preference thing, all right? It's all preference. We gotta put, oh, we gotta put the Tin Man down. Also, that's just making me think that you have a chili bowl, which is, which would be most excellent. All right, we're gonna put our little, little the little fella. Look at this little fella. Boy, look at that little fella. He'll watch us while we sleep. Good night. Oh wait, we can't see him. Good night. I want him to be right in front of me whenever we go to bed. Is it on this side? Good night. Okay, now he can see us, very good. Uh, I did die it. <laughs> if I did die, you don't know what you'd go for? A chili bowl? Yeah, that's the haircut where you put a literal bowl on your head and then you cut around the edges of the bowl. You know, you like, you put a big, big round bowl on your noggin and then you cut around the edge and you make it like perfectly even around your entire hair. Oh, like Smosh? What? Like Smosh? What? The 2010 Smosh? What? 2010 Smosh. I don't think that that's full chili, is it? I don't think that's 100% chilied. Oh, one of them looks kind of chilied up. I didn't watch much Smosh when I was younger. I was more of a balloon shop kid. I'm looking for chili bowls. I don't, I don't see any of them extreme enough. No, a chili bowl is like Oliver Tree. That's what, that's what you're gonna think of. You're gonna think, you're gonna think Oliver Tree. All right. All you youngsters. Hey up, hey up, hey up. Your mom used to do that to your hair? Well, it's a really, it's a really cheap style to do. It's definitely something that you can pull off at home. It's not, it's not that bad, it's just old, that's all. 
It's just out of style, okay? It was a trend. It was it was trendy. It was a good hairstyle for like 10 minutes. <gasps> it's oops! Oh my god! You guys, behold. The the only confirmation that I'm gay. It's my boyfriend. <laughs> Hello, oops! Oops! <laughs> nice hair! Look at me! Look at me! Aren't I beautiful? Aren't I beautiful? Oh, oops. It's lovely to see you. Uh, I actually really need to bleach and dye my hair. I miss my teal. Ooh, we were actually, I was talking about the, um, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I was talking about blue, blue and green apparently don't come out of your hair. Or at least like some blues and greens just don't come out of hair. Like once you dye it, once you dye it blue or green, like that's it. You're done. You get, you get one try. You get, might as well just chop off all that hair from what I've heard. And now I'm, I'm kind of happy that I didn't do the uh, didn't do the mermaid teal that I was thinking of, but you already know that it works for you. Listen, I've I've got no focus, and my hair is like relatively long now. Hey, what's up, Scott? Oh, the hair is different. Glad that you switched it up and took a risk. Yeah, I mean, what the heck? Why not? Life's short, Scott. Life's short. Life's short. Live it up. Oh yeah, and Alchemic mentioned the the pride. The, the Pride Herkimer Diamond Vodka. The Dan Aykroyd's Pride Mug. Mmm. It looks kind of ugly though, doesn't it, Alk? Don't you think it looks ugly and tacky? Doesn't it look like it's made out of plastic? It looks like what dishes would be made out of if you got dishes from Walmart. Or like... Or it looks like beads. It looks like a, a plastic that you would get like... A bead necklace from Dollar Tree or something. Also, Fluffy Giraffe, what's up? You need some cheering up? Got any cheerers in the chat, you guys? Gay and tacky. Yes, it's tacky. Listen, I'm listen. I I'm not tacky. I'm not a tacky guy. Name one tacky thing about me. Name one tacky thing, and maybe I'll consider it. Okay. Uh, there we go. Got the goodies. Got the goodies. Scott, how are you doing, by the way? Scott, Scott, Scott. Always good to see ya. Always good to see ya. We're just, uh, we're just playing, we're just playing some Rafty. Because I, I was at the salon for six hours today. <laughs> so I'm a little bit late. And I didn't have any time to plan anything. I was going to do, like, a special game and do, like, a hype setup and have a bunch of things. A bunch of things going? I was so excited and then the it took like four extra hours. Not tacky, but definitely wacky. Mythical, are you trying to be Dr. Seuss? Or... Got some Dr. Seuss vibes in, emanating from you today. Not tacky. Definitely wacky. Are you thinking? Are you thinking? What are you thinking? You're gonna get some green tea and some food? Sounds good. Taka, thank you again. Thank you again. Get your food. Get your sustenance. Harvest thy sustenance. Dyeing your hair is something you really wanna do? You gotta do it. You gotta do it. If you have crappy hair already, do it yourself. If you have good hair that you don't wanna mess up, just pay somebody to do it. It's worth it, okay? Listen, like I said, life short. Life short and and hair is just dead cells clinging to your scalp, okay? Listen, we're just over we're just overgrown monkeys that get to live for about 80 years that have dead cells on our scalp. Have fun with it. Why not? Oh, I can eat these breads. I don't I don't aw, you being you being sweet. Jackson's being sweet. Fluffy giraffe, I'm sorry that you're having a crummy day. And if you don't like it, just shave it off. That is that is easier for some rather than others, Jackson. But I, I do agree with you. Ah, dang it, why am I just throwing everything out? I want the silver smoothie. I'm thirsty. I'm a thirsty boy. You dyed your hair blue once and a bunch of local teens where I live, that I was living at the same time thought it was cool and suddenly all the kids were showing up with blue hair. What? You created a, you created a trend. You're a trendsetter, Gene Fruits. Can't believe it. 
can't believe that you're setting trends without me now. What happened? What happened to our trend partnership? You're supposed to only set trends at the same time. There you are. All right, let's dump le junk. Dump le junk. Come on, come on. I know you want to buy to this. I know you want to buy to this stop sign that I got here. Uh -huh. Bonk. Get out of here, Buster. You gotta bonk them on the nose, and then then they leave. They come, they eat, they leave. They come, they eat, they leave. There we go. Now we now we've gotten rid of all of our stuff. I, I, there's so much stuff to steal off this island. No! Put that back down. Okay, 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 okay. Now we can. Ooh, copper ingot. Copper ingot. Copper ingot. We're getting a lot of uh, getting a lot of biofuel out here, you guys. Lots of biofuel. A suspicious amount. Does BP exist in this universe? We don't need a fish while we're on this island. Oh, we're gonna need more food, I think. We're gonna starve. We're gonna starve and die, but what will we eat? I don't have any... Uh, I have a little bit of stuff. Should I just cook the radishes? We only have a little bit more to do on this island. We're so close. We're so close, we can almost leave. We can almost leave, but we can't. Cook the potatoes. I figured we all locked our houses anyway because of COVID. It'll most likely grow back. Exactly. See, this is the perfect time. Whenever you're locked inside, that's whenever you start going crazy. There's a charity in Australia that's about raising money for people to shave their heads. And you're waiting for that. Yeah, Mythical. There's, uh, there's one in the US too that's called uh, Locks of Love, I think. My friend, uh, I had a friend in high school that grew his hair for locks of love. I know that the, it's a little bit of a sussy, it's a little bit of a sussy organization, but it's still, uh, you know, it's still pretty wholesome from what I, from what I've researched. Let's, what was I going to do? You guys, what, what was my, what was, what was my plan? What was I, I had big plans for a second. I don't remember what it was. What was I doing? What? What was I do? My... I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, yes. Sleep with the robot. There was, uh, there was at least a few US locks of love. Just the most known, a little sussy. Yeah, some of them are kind of sussy. My mom would never let me grow my hair out that long. She would never let me do it. Okay, my mom was less reasonable whenever she was younger, all right? She thought that, that Pikachu was Satan. My mom originally thought that Pikachu was a Satanist icon, but you know what? We found out that actually he loves Jesus. Yeah, oh, Matt Smart Blonde! Hey! What's up, what's up? <laughs> 23 months, baby! Oh, Oi! Almost two been? years! Almost two years. Almost two years. Ah, Matt Smart, how are you doing? I feel like I should know what it's like to have very short hair. You know what? That's a fun life experience. Okay. It's fun to try. Hey! Bonehead! Oh, wait a second. I think I ignored your message. I'm sorry. Who said, who said, who said what? Wait a minute. Somebody said something somewhere. Yeah. Oh, Bonehead, you said, hey, Kenny. Fabulous hair. Thank you. I'm sorry for ignoring you. My bad. My bad. Still stressing? Oof. That's smart. Life be do be life do be speedy. Life be too speedy. Still stressing, but only one job now. That's good. That's good. At least it's getting a bit better. It's getting a bit better. Wait, what? Zipline part. Oh. I think we have to find a special building to put the zip line together. Mass smart, we're just goofing around playing some playing some spicy raft. I have a new hairstyle. Are there any other updates on Math Smart's end? Have you been watching any good shows? Met any cool people? Did you eat any delicious food? Did you hunt a rare and that half extinct animal oh oh 
Need to find the infirmary. The infirmary you have to use a zip line for. It's this cent it's this center building that you put the zip line together on, I think. Yeah, right here. Use three zip line parts. And now we have the quote unquote zip line tool. And now we're able to zip. Let's see, but Oh, I think that it's just an automatic thing. It says require zip line tool. I just got that. Oh, you have to put it on your person and it breaks. So silly. Oh, you have to jump off as well. Uh, you've been living life to the full. Living a life full of indulgence. Carnal indulgence. I mean, that sounds pretty rad. That sounds pretty good. Getting up to shenanigans. It's the second time that I've said it this stream. But listen, shenanigans will be had. Y'all you're, are chaotic. Y'all are chaotic neutrals. Oh, the healing salve. Forgot about that. Now we can heal ourselves just by rubbing jelly on our wounds. Jelly wound sauce. Oh, frick. Why are my pockets always full? Wait, I can throw these out. We don't need we don't need blueprints. I don't have to remember how to make anything. I can remember. Mmm, wound sauce. It's the perfect it's the perfect topping for any wound. It's the only way to enjoy a proper scab. Hang on. Snacking on rad. Mm, I'm feeling a little radish today. Wait. Is that it? Have we done? Did we get everything? Is that everything on this island? Oh, oh, it's the blueprints. We already, we already took care of that. Hmm. What do I? Okay, I think we got everything here, except for those pigs. We could always p kill these rascals, but you know what? I feel like the pigs get to live another day. Oh wait, we could use the bow maybe. Hang on, hang on. Let's see what kind of damage. See what kind of damage we can do on these boars. Shenanigans is a good good word. It's the name of a um like one of those places where you can go bowling and it has an arcade and it's got pool. There's a place called Shenanigans in the US that's like that. And they've got uh they've got go-karts that are indoors. Oh, nice kill. Nice murder. Aww. Okay, but we got our arrows back. That's all that really matters and we dropped the leather. Let's see what what else can we Oh, we could put on the we could put on the breathing mask. It's a genius. I Hope that the I don't know if it actually like lowers the uh, The health of stuff if you're not using it because we don't we don't need to air on land There's plenty enough. Oh my god. There's so many pigs. We gotta make sure that we're shooting at just one of them or we won't have the arrows for this. Is that hitting him? I can genuinely not tell. I think one of them got him. Sticking into him. Is he stuck? What's wrong with this man? Somebody save this man from himself. He knows not what he's doing. Yikes. The game's fully released, you guys. This is what a completed game in 2022 looks like. See the difference? We need to go back to the arcades. Pac-Man was a better game. We have a place that's called Scandia Family Fun Center. Oh my goodness. Scandia. Oh no! Scandinavia. That's what uh, Finland's in Scandinavia, right? Because it's not in Scandinavia. Which countries are Scandinavian? And which countries are Scandinavian? <laughs> Open her up! Loads of leather. We'll be able to make plenty of clothes. Mm -mm -mm, Mr. Krabs. You won't believe how many clothes I made. I can't do the voice today. I was screaming metal songs in the car and I busted my voice, you guys. It's fully busted. There'll be no recovery this evening. So just give it up. There's gonna be no Pooh Bear voice. No John Jones Jameson. Ooh. What should we, what should we do? Ooh. I'm eating the broth. Poison soup. 
All right, now we catch Lebby's. Lebby. Hey, Salty, what's up? Yo. Yo, what's up? Salty. Oh my god. Shouts out Salty. One of my favorite streamers ever. One of my favorite peeps ever. Oh, Salty, what kind of shenanigans are you up to? My hair's amazing? Oh, why, well, thank you. I'm not gonna lie. You you definitely inspired me a little bit, okay? I was like, Salty's always got cool hair. I guess I gotta... I look like that character from Nier Automata. I look like the, the kawaii waifu. I need to get... I need to get the... The, the face band. I need to have a blindfold on. Then I could be a then I can be a hot anime babe finally. Finally. Oh my god. Peter. You look like an <laughs> a robot lady. Hey, Peter. Peter. Okay, my voice still doesn't work, sorry. You had to stop by and see the hair. Look at it. Feast your eyes on it. Look at it. I want you all to look at it. What am I gonna do now? My pockets are full of plastic. Did you know that plastic doesn't biodegrade very quickly? I was reading somewhere that they're making a new chemical that'll eat plastic, but you know what? That sounds like, that sounds like a hoax. <gasps> the mayor's hat. If you die with the mayor's hat on, then you lose it forever, as far as I know. Cause I, cause I lost it that very way. Saddest, saddest thing that ever happened to me. When I lost my mayor hat, <laughs> I've got the big bottle on my face. <laughs> Thank you for the raid, Goofy. Goofy scoots and rolls. Thank you for the raid. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Thank you, Goofy. Goofy. I saw you. Oi, oi, Goofy. Thanks so much. Thanks so much for the raid. How was your game? What'd you play? What did you play, you rascal? You rascal. Kenny, a boyfriend. <laughs> Kenny, a boyfriend of Opsty needs love too. How have you been? I've been so well. And Vonchik, what's up? Look at my hair. That's what, it's the scooter raid. Scoot to your party. You were last playing art. What kind of art were you making? What kind of? Dubious art. You drawing with crayons? I hope you didn't hear what I said about crayons earlier. We need to go back. We need to go back, because I don't have room for nothing. Oh, wait, we're getting rid of the poison pufferfish head. You guys, we know, know that we don't need that. Leftovers. Out of here. We need to zip back. There's nothing on this island. This is the island of junk. Le junk. Pepe le frog. Here we go. Who took my Kenny? What? Your Kenny? You have possession? You have possession of the Earl? <laughs> Earl's been possessed? Hmm. So the thing that we're missing is battery charger, huh? Battery charger parts. We need three of them? How many do we have? Do you guys have any idea how many? We got two. We got two. We're getting there. We're almost there. We're almost there, but... We're not there. We need to go back. We have to go back. The game looks so pretty. It's definitely got a distinctive art style. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Do we need an exerciser? <laughs> Are you saying like somebody that that exercises demons or somebody that 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 wait exercises or exercises? Is that how you say those things? You were possessed until you purchased Dan Aykroyd's specialty crystal skull triple diamond filtered vodka. Triple Herkimer diamond filled <laughs> vodka. It'll solve your life's problems. My marriage was saved by Dan Aykroyd's triple distilled Herkimer diamond filtered premium vodka for vodka lovers everywhere. Nothing can match the quality of this incredibly refined vodka that's made all the way up in Canada. Isn't it made? It's made in Nova, Nova Scotian water. Triple Herkimer Diamond, double press sealed, platinum super edition Poggies. 
This is an unopened house. I don't actually know where the last... Dan Aykroyd believes in aliens. Why are you... Why is that a heart? Why is that a heart? <laughs> Salty, he only likes... He, he only likes unknown aliens. He only likes dangerous aliens. <laughs> Dan Aykroyd doesn't want friendly aliens. He wants to be probed. Let's be honest. All the people that are obsessed with aliens, they want to be probed. <laughs> I can't get rid of any of my stuff. My pockets are swollen. Oh, boy. My pockets are swollen. My pockets are stuffed with so much of Piglet's stuff. My pockets are filled with honey. <laughs> My pockets are filled with bees, and they're buzzing and buzzing. Honey, I'm home. Whose pockets is? <laughs> There's a walker in my pocket. Yeah, Oi, Kodak Zack! <laughs> Thank you for the sub! Yo! Can we get some hype in the chat? Dude's Kodak Zack! Look at me! <laughs> Kodak Zack. What the heck is up? What the heck is up, Zack? It's good to see you. Good to see you. It's more pleasant to be you. I don't have any water at the desk, and I'm so thirsty. Thirstiest streamer award goes to the Earl of Boats. Oh, need a straw hat? What? You want me to? You want me to shame this hair by putting a straw hat on, dude? Is that true, dude? Oh shucks. Oh, OT. OT's got it on one side, right? What's up, everybody? <laughs> Beardos and beardos. I need... Wait. What kind of glasses does OT use, though? He uses the... He uses aviators, right? I have a pair of aviators. Aren't they aviators? Hey, what's up, Gamer Boss? It's GamerBox666. What's up, beardos and weirdos? <laughs> What's up, beardos and weirdos? It's me, Little OT. Today, we're gonna be reviewing some of the funniest Reddit content that I found this week. Oh my God, you will not believe some of these posts. They're gonna blow your eyeballs out. Reddit is always good for a laugh, so let's get right into these posts, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And click that notification bell if you wanna be alerted every time that I upload a video. We're gonna be making a lot of hot content this week, so make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss any of that. Can't. I'm trying to get rid of items, but there's too much. The babyest OT. What's up, everybody? <laughs> it's me, baby OT. You take advantage of hats when you don't have that stylish of hair. <laughs> That's true. That's true. You told me the truth. Uh, so wait, are drinks for getting healthy instead of exercising? <laughs> exercising demons? If only he recorded one like that. No. No. Oh. There's a, there's a bad thing on my head, you guys. I can feel something bad in my head. There's something, there's something there, but I can't pick at it. Oh, there's two bad things. I can feel two bad things on my scalp. I will not show you them, but there's something bad going on under there. I'm not picking. I didn't, I just touched it. I just touched it. I just touched it. It's something big. It's something big. Is it a brain? No, I said something big. <laughs> oh, the best music. Best music. Hop on off. Don't touch your scalp. I know. Okay. I'm not touching it anymore. Okay. Listen, I'm not an American picker. I don't walk around old people's property and steal their valuable garbage. What's a brain? Mommy, what's a brain? It's what you don't have, sweetie. Don't worry. Life's much easier without it. Just look at how happy our cat Muffins is feeling right now. Wow. Muffins doesn't have a brain. 
and he gets around just fine. Just be like Muffins, babe, and you'll, and, you'll, and you'll make it in this world. But Mom, who's gonna feed me Fancy Feast? You're not supposed to eat that, that's cat food. But Mom, it tastes just like the tuna. Where's our, where's our copper stash? My child is my cat. Put that back. Okay, we need to find out. Where's the last one, you guys? Where's the last battery? Hey, where's the last battery, man? Hey, there's some battery part hidden on this island. We have to find it. It's hidden somewhere in the rubble. This city was destroyed a long time ago, and now we've come upon it. There's nobody left. Everyone's dead. Except for the chickens. There are little chickens up here. <gasps> the music. Yes. Yoshi. <laughs> Let's -a go. Super Mario Sunshine. Ho, ho, ho. Wahoo. Mario. Mario, Mario. Yoshi. Mario. Yoshi. Mario. Was I a water cannon? Oh no! You're dead! M -m 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 Mario! No, no, boys, don't touch that stuff. <laughs> What's this sticky paint like go? It's moving! No, no, boys, don't kill this chicken. <clears throat> Toad wants violence! <laughs> Toad will kill! Come back! <laughs> He's allowed on the island. Look at him go. No, no, boys. Come back. Yes. Yeah. I'll tell you the saddest thing. Nothing to be harvested. There's no goodies inside. It's nothing but an empty corpse. An empty corpse. Huh? Kenny, you just made me think of how OT calls Kirby Yoshi. What? He calls Kirby Yoshi, but he whines about people saying Lego wrong. Oh my God. What a hypocrite. I cannot believe that he doesn't pronounce everything literally perfect all the time. How dare they? Listen, as soon as you become a YouTuber, you sign a contract that you have to say everything perfect 100% of the time. Guys, I've lost my brain. Wherever... It's probably leaking out of my brain through the weird thing that I felt on my... <gasps> Battery charger. We found it. Never mind. Brain has been reset. Skip. Speedrun strat. Wait. Wait, that was... That was not a speedrun strat. Oh, no. Bow, bow, bow. They don't look a thing alike. Mario's a monkey now. What? Wahoo! Oh no! I'm hairy! Oh no! I'm a monkey! I'm a soup! I'm a tiger! <laughs> Wahoo! Where's the... Where do we make the bat... Oh! <laughs> Battery charger. Can be connected with fuel pipes. Now, could anybody... Explain to me why the heck they made these blueprints. I am so angry. I'm so angry, and I don't know why. <laughs> I'm a tired. <laughs> I'm a tired. <laughs> Wahoo. Sploosh. Hashtag sploosh. All right, back to the boat. I think we got everything on this island. That should be it. Wait, yeah, because we used the infirmary key, right? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did we get everything that we needed? Aww, that's cute. It's got a little radish on there. The mayor's chest key has a little radish on it, a little, a little uwu radish. Listen, everything that I draw eventually gets an uwu face on it. It's the only way. The blueprints are pretty useless. They count as an inventory slot and they make you nervous initially, like you have to have them, but you don't. You don't have to keep them because look, it says battery charger there. But look, it, 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 the battery charger is right 
I don't actually remember which thing is in. Battery. Oh, we won't even have it because you have to research it at the table. But you don't need a blueprint for that. They should just make it so that it disappears. This game's been released as 1.0. Did nobody mention this to them? Did they never come up with this? Huh. It's a very simple idea. It's called don't waste my inventory with a useless item. But that's clearly a far too advanced idea for these developers. They'll never understand. <gasps> biter. Oh, biter. They bit. Also, my machete. Where did my precious machete go? Mm. Uh, I can't even make it. Can't even make a machete if I wanted one. See, look, they're right there. You can just research them. Battery charger. Yeah, see, we gotta have we gotta have titanium. We need titanium. What about for what about for the goodies? What about for the machete? Huh? Wait, what? Oh, we can make the machete. Wait, wait. Shouldn't it be in the fighting zone? Oh, it's over here. I'm silly. I'm a silly, silly boy. Wow, we made another one. That was that was almost too easy. I feel like I made no effort to get this machete. All right. Uh. Oh yeah. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh yeah, I was gonna double check. Did we open a mayor's chest? Oh yeah, cause that's where we got the mayor's hat. Ta -da! And it says mayor on it. That's how you know. That's how you know that it's the mayor's hat. I'm the mayor of this ship. Yeah. Uh oh, you gotta go get some breakfast. Hey, enjoy your breakfast. Hey, I say it like that cause I, I often skip breakfast. Good job, Mythical. Actually taking care of yourself. Enjoy your brekkie. Good luck with the rest of your day. Oi. Eh. Oink, oink, oink. Breakfast sounds good right now. It's never too late for breakfast. Me and my friends, whenever we went and watched Lightyear, we went to Denny's and got a breakfast meal, and it was delicious. It was delicious. Breakfast food is the best food, you guys. Bar none. Bar none, best meal. All the time. Where where do we go now? Oh, we didn't get the we didn't get the the paper yet. Oh, it's probably it's probably just hanging up because they're normally just little um they're normally just little sticky notes. We gotta go find the sticky note. There's one thing. There's one more thing that we gotta find, and it's the most important thing on this. Oh, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Oh yeah, I didn't give y'all a full review of uh, Lightyear. Okay. Without spoiling anything that's not in the trailer. I gotta give you a short short synopsis of my opinions on Lightyear. Because everybody asked. Okay. The design and the voice did not bother me as much as I thought. I thought that I'd be annoyed that it's not Tim Allen, even though I don't like Tim Allen. I thought I'd be annoyed, but the voice was actually really good. The voice was good. The design was kind of funny. I kept laughing at Buzz. I kept looking at him and laughing. It was funny. Uh, there is another character in the movie that I will not name that is designed so poorly that me and my friends burst out laughing every time they were on screen without fail, could not help ourselves. It was so goofy. It was so funny. Um, okay, we need to go over to the mayor's. But the cat, the cat that's in the trailer, that's why I don't feel bad about it. It's not a spoiler, but the robot cat is okay. by far. Hey! The robot cat is the best part of the movie. They are adorable at all times and very, very funny. They absolutely saved the movie. Like the movie was still not very good, but the cat was very funny. And it kept it kept doing new things that were adorable. It was very funny. I like that. I like the cat a lot. Um, the weirdest thing about Lightyear that made us very upset, made us very upset. I mean, honestly, I'm shocked. I don't know if this is considered a spoiler. I don't think that it is. I would just like to, this is, consider this a warning. In the trailer, you see plants. You see plants and bugs on this island, okay? You see plants and bugs. Just to warn you, there's no aliens in this movie. There's no aliens. There's no other species, dude. It's so boring. It's so basic. I cannot believe. Okay. But they didn't make any aliens. None. I thought this was Star Command, bruh. No aliens. Just just plants. 
plants and bugs, non-speaking entities. It was so boring. Yeah, what's the point of trying to build a universe with Lightyear? I know, right? There was no aliens. It was a, w yeah, it felt like a waste of time. It was just wasted potential. Like the visuals are great. There's a pretty good story arc that went on. There was some good emotion in the movie. There were, there's a really cute cat. Like there was good parts to it, but the soul of the movie was rotten. It was rotten. Its core was rotten, but it had like a lot of nice lights that could distract you for a little while if you want to. If you, if you want to watch it, I mean, I wasn't bored. I wasn't bored. I was either laughing at the movie or with the movie at all times. That or Jurassic Domain? Mmm. Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Oh, what's up, Dai? Hey, how are you doing? And Nezumi, hello. How's the stream so far? I hope it's been fun. Well, the stream's been, it was only going for a couple hours because I my hair appointment took six hours because they bleached it three times. They bleached it three times and then they left the dye in my hair for so long that I could smell it burning. And then they had to, then they washed it and straightened it and then cut off all the, all the dead ends and then trimmed it. Oh my gosh. It was, it was such an experience. I've never had a haircut that lasted longer than 30 minutes. And here I am with a six hour appointment. Pretty affordable though. Um, I'm shocked that they let you go white in one sitting. Well, he said that my hair was super healthy. He said that, um, that my hair, because it had like a red tint to it, he knew that it would turn pretty quickly. Um, and he decided to take extra long to make sure that we didn't just like nuke the hair in a short, in a short amount of time. Like he, he took his time. That's why it took six hours because he took his time with it and was like, look, if, if we can't, if we can't make it look good, really slow with weaker, with weaker bleach, then we might just have to make this a, a two, a two step process. 7204. 7204. Yeah, I gave him a big tip. 72. All right, Bazinga. That's where we're supposed to go. Which is this way. All right, we're ready to get out of here. This island is worthless. The Actually, this island does have a use. The use is that it has those uh, puffer fish, which are kind of hard to find anywhere else. Whoa! Hey! Reverse! 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 Hit the nitrous. Oh. Oh. All right. <laughs> Hurry. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Now we're on the move. Yahoo. Okay. Arr, matey. Arr, matey. Everybody aboard. Hey, ho, and up she rises. Hey, ho, and... Jurassic Dominion was an action film. That's all I have to say about that. Oh, um, yeah, I watched the my uncle's in the screenwriting guild. So he gets like early screeners for movies and he got an early screener for Jurassic World, the first Chris Pratt movie. And we all watched as a family and we were like, uh, not very good. Listen, so it's not just me not liking Chris Pratt. OK, my whole family thought that. And they like Chris Pratt and Chris Pratt movies, okay? It's only me that doesn't like him. But yeah, we didn't we didn't like it. I don't I didn't really like it at all. The only Jurassic Park movie that I've liked so far is the first one. I only like Jurassic Park, Jurassic Park so far. But I still haven't I still haven't watched the second or third one. But judging by the IMDb, uh, I might not be missing much. I just need to aim this a little bit to the right. You like Jurassic World because it had a monosaur and monosaur is your fave. That's totally valid reason. I also, I mean, I like some elements of it. I really like the, uh, the, the balls that they rode around in. You add balls to a movie and I'm immediately like, okay, now this is, this is, this is a cool idea. You know, there was definitely some cool ideas going on. Just not quite enough for me. I'm, I'm pretty whiny anyway, so. Whininess is my brand. I should become a, uh, should become a YouTuber. <laughs> I should become a, a YouTuber that just writes two-hour videos 
reviewing one game. How about that? What if I, yeah, maybe I should, maybe I should review this game for two hours and be like, Raft, Ra why Raft is the mediocre masterpiece? <laughs> it's two hours long. Now, today we're gonna be talking about Raft and I have a lot to say, but first, I wanna give you all a brief overview of video game development. Starting back in 1985, the first real video game was released to the public, and its impact cannot be understated. Now going over the video game crash, you do love a good video essay, you'd watch it? Die, you're the, <laughs> the same as I am. I can't, I can't help. I, 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 that's all that I do all day. I watch four, I watched four video essays today. 85? No, I'm, I'm just making it up. I'm just making it up, Callie. Okay, here we are. Boy, I go for, I, whenever I see H Bomber guy release a video where he's like, this game is, is okay. Here's why. It's six hours long. I'm like, all right, time to dig in. Get the popcorn. Mom, I'm watching H Bomber guy right now. Okay, we need a battery charger. Oh wait, you need titanium for that. It'd be easier for me to just buy another battery, to be honest. Listen, this is this is the issue with real life batteries too. It's easier to just make more instead of recycle them. Boop. Boop. Alright. Now we can now we can read where we are. We're a thousand meters away. I'm going to bed. Sunny V2 hits different with some video essays. What is Sunny V2? Yeah, Jenny Nicholson. I love her videos. Her videos good. She's very she's very sassy and tacky. I like her opinions. Gimme, gimme. Oh my gosh, look at all this trash. Look at all this trash. My dad took my brother to watch Jurassic World when I was like nine. And he, the irresponsible father, he took me too. I had nightmares for several months, and I was slightly crying through like half the movie. Oh no! <laughs> Nazami, no! You were scarred. You were scarred for life. Scarred for life by a dinosaur. Some children love dinosaurs. Nazami love is scared of them. Because their father brought them to watch the scariest dinosaur movie in the world. Jurassic Park. Your favorite dino is the pterodactyl because people thought that they were dragon skeletons. <laughs> I mean, they might as well be, right? I think that, that dragons and uh, dinosaurs are, you know, they're neighbors, they're cousins. Okay, we gonna put the... Yo, this music just got kind of, uh... Kind of relaxing. I might fall asleep. Mmm, cozy. Everybody get in the blanket. I have one large blanket that we can all share. Beep boop, beep boop. Let's dump all the junk. Junk dumper. Man, I'm gonna have to have a blueprint box. Ooh. Yum, yum. Sunny V2 has some really in intriguing vids. I've never even heard of them. How did I miss that? How did I miss out on some quality essay content? <gasps> oh, that's not a, oh, there's two islands on the horizon. I can barely see them outside of the spawning area. <laughs> it's 900 meters away, is that it? You love blankets? Can confirm, Linz loves blankets. Linz lives in a blanket. Linz is a blanket. Linz skin is actually a small, it's a small layer of linen over it. Wow! Internet scandals and dramas? Oh boy. Now if there's one thing that I could care about less, it's YouTube drama. Listen, I want to hear about real life drama. I want to hear about why the Romans had bad ideas and stuff. Oh, huzzah. Nice. What about these things? Do we even need these grills anymore? Hmm. Mm hmm. We could really develop this boat. We could really develop it if we wanted to. But you know what? I think that we're just going to uh, spam our way through this story really quick. Okay. I want y'all to. I want y'all to see sights. I 
want y'all to see sights. I want y'all to hear new sounds. This music sounds like Castle Crasher music. <laughs> oh, I want now I want to listen to the bonus bonus stage music of Castle Crashers. Let me see. Oh wait, no, it's not. It's not Castle Crash. Is it? Castle, Castle, Crashers, music. Yeah, it's that one song. What's the one song called? It's like a bonus area, Clown Town. What's the What's the clown song? Isn't there Isn't there a, a, a song with a bonus area or something? I can't remember what it's called. Everybody loves that song, but I I don't see it. Does anybody know the name of it? Hey! Get off my boat! Oh. oh! He broke the boat, but I smacked him in the nose. Was it worth it? Oh no, we're about to crash land on the island! <laughs> ah! Stop! Stop the presses! Stop the engines! Ah! Okay. Whew. Whew, that was- oh! <laughs> that was super close. Oh mama. Oh mama. A documentary where you know that the plane crashes. Oh, what? Listen, I only like, I I normally like my video essays to have like an end to them. I like them to have a solution at the end. Okay, wait, 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 where's the music? Orange's Kiss, is that what it's called? Yeah, there it is. Yo ho ho, friends. Let's hippity hop onto the island. Oh boy, oh boy, what kind of treasure will we find? <laughs> this is this is some maniacal music. Yeehaw! Grab the axes! Harvest the goodies off the island! Ah, there we go. Climb the pole! Is that it? That's the end of the song? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why is it? It's repeating. It's just gonna cause me to go mad within three playthroughs. <laughs> okay. Hey! No hitting! No hitting! That's one more replay. That's one more replay, Calico. Every bat equals a replay. Yahoo! Any goodies in the water? Let's take a look. No, this is the dance of the orange the orange princess turns into a clown, spoiler alert. It's an old it's an old game, okay. But all of the knights get a kiss. But then the orange knight turns into a clown and go and dances to this music. It's like the final troll of the game. The final slap in the face for anybody that wanted to finish that game. Kissing, how lewd! You're not allowed to say the K word. Another one, Salty? Alright, bet. Could be my new juggling music. Can I juggle in this tiny area? Oh, I forgot about air. The balls have been juggled. Well done. Wait a minute. Did I fool y'all for a second that I was replaying it? No, it was just set on repeat. What is that? It's got, there's a bonus stage for what's that other what's that other game? It's called Battle Battle Block. Battle Block. Bat bat. Yeah, Battle Block bonus stage. 
music, please. Battle Plot Theater Music, Secret Area, is this it? There it is. Perfect music. Look at all the snoms! Look at the snoms! <gasps> Who's got the frog snom? That's cute! Is that Cassidot? It is Cassidot! I didn't know that they got a snom. That's adorable. I love that baby. Look at that little frog baby. Okay, we need more... We need more water. <laughs> ah! The shark's going for it. Whack! You're gonna die. You're dying tonight. You're dying tonight, mister. Get over here. Oh, it's literally new as of today. Okay, good. I don't know what my commission would be, though, Salty. I thought about it. I thought about it whenever you sent it to me, but I don't, I don't know what I'd get. Just a squirrel one? It looked too much like yours. Maybe if I got, like... Maybe with ears? <laughs> Kill! <laughs> Why is he still alive? <gasps> We're gonna die! If he hits me again! Oh. If we die, we'll lose the hat. Yeah, I'm putting the hat away just in case. Okay, Snom is kind of cute. What do you mean, kind of cute? Snom is a darling little butt-faced baby. Everybody loves Snom. Was that in any... Was that ever in question? That Snom is adorable? A little skull Snom? Aww. That would be cute. A little goth Snom with a bunch of makeup on. We need to cook some food. I think we gotta go fishing again. Wait, 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 wait. We need to kill him. You just looked him up. You don't know Pokemon? Well, I mean, that's okay. We need to play more Pokemon Smash and Pass so that I can... So that I can, uh... Educate you on all the Pokemon in the game. Where's the stupid fish? I want to kill him, but I'm too weak right now. I'm too weak to hop in the water. He's over there. Smash and pass. <laughs> that's just disrespectful. <laughs> that's, that's not even. That's not even friendly. Come here. Where's that stupid old fish. Boy, the original Pokemon Snom looks like something I will not say. Good. Don't say it. <laughs> we'll say it looks like a butt. It's got a front butt. But like next Doodle stream, I'm requesting a snom. It actually seems it seems like it'd be a relatively easy shape to do. Get over here, you stupid fish! Can I grab this stuff out of here? Did I just did I see? Oh, there are no goodies in there. How is there a? It looks like there's a box that's stuck. Is that the anchor? Hey, get over here, bruh. I want to kill the shark because we actually need the food right now. Hello? Oh, we can we can take a hit now. There we go. We got him. Perfect. Now we cook the fish. We're starving. Darvin Marvin. All right, I'm eating a radish just in case. We're supposed to cook all the food though. What a waste, dude. Die have still not recovered from your answers. Oh my gosh, Die had the worst takes ever, man. Die had the worst takes I've ever read. Okay, that was that was awesome, but that's enough. Okay, I know y'all asked for that, but. Gotta put a limit somewhere, okay? I can't just keep repeating that the whole time just because y'all keep asking for it. Alright, let's stack some junk. And what do we need as a, as a real rafter? What do we need more of? We could get more bricks and make more heater things? Mm. You're gonna make your Sona as a snom? You have a, I didn't know that you had a Sona Jackson. Is it your, is it your, your profile picture? 
Oh, uh, your profile picture doesn't look like a... That looks like a woof. Blindfold on a snom? Yeah, I should make a near automata 2B snom with a little blindfold on and some like hair that kind of that kind of bounces around. <laughs> okay, we can do like one more objective before the end of the stream. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna? Oh my God, we're gonna die. How do you like that? How do you like them apples? How do you like them shark apples? Oh, your son has a blindfold. Oh, I'm just I'm just stealing your idea, Jackson. I'm just art thieving right now. Don't mind me, just stealing from art. You know, just artist things. Man, I think that we gotta build one more. We gotta build one more big box. This box is just gonna hold. I mean, it's not one more big box, but this is going to be the blueprint box because I just don't want to get rid of them because this game has literally scared me, okay? I'm literally scared that I'm going to need these later, okay? There's absolutely no reason why I would need these, but this, this game has tricked me. I have been tricked. I feel like these, I feel like these matter. I, I absolutely, I absolutely took the bait, but I'm sorry. I have to, it's safety first, you guys. I'm the kind of guy that just uh, hoards all the health potions and then never uses them during the final boss. I don't use the health potions whenever I need them. Then whenever I get to the final boss, I don't even use them there. Then I end the game with a bunch of extra, bunch of extra stuff for no reason. Oh, we'll see you later, the all-knowing cheese. Uh, I was supposed to go to bed three hours ago. You got <laughs> gonna hop to play some Minecraft? <laughs> so you stayed up because of the stream. And now you're gonna now you're gonna play some Minecraft. I mean, have a good time. Have a good time, boy. We'll see you later. Enjoy your Minecraft. <laughs> oi oi. Oi. Choto. Choto matte. Choto choto choto. Oh, wait. Pull it up. Pull up the anchor. Here we go. A vest. A vest. The island that we're supposed to go to is like right in front of us. Full speed. Full speed. Batten up the hatches. Wahoo. Let's go. All right, this next island that we're heading to, I'm trying to remember what it is. I, I can't remember. You guys, it's gonna be a surprise for all of us. It's a surprise for everybody. What's on the next island? Nobody knows. Nobody knows, it's a secret. It's a secret held by the mob for years, hundreds of years. Our family, the Maronis, has defended this secret. Listen, now that you're old enough, I'm gonna tell you all the secrets. Just steer your ship this way. You'll find ancient Moroni treasure. There we go. What are y'all talking about? What What are y'all talking about right now? Oh my gosh. My mods are half the problem as usual. This music's jamming. What the heck are we listening to? Dude, this is the best song. What is this song? Sonic Runners? No! No, not Sonic music! No! Ah, oh, yuck. Feel like I've been tricked. I'm Sonic. We're being played on a stream right now. I know, Chili Dogs. Brum, brum, brum. Sonic, don't touch my piss rocks. You picked us, Kenny. We are a problem of your design. <laughs> you design your mods, you customize them. Customizable, some ready-made designs in case you want, or you can customize from scratch. Sonic has a lot of bops. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Sonic does have some jams. And also Sonic's got some funny jokes in that Sonic Boom show seen a lot of boom clips out of context and they're pretty funny. 
See that weird dome thing? That's where we're headed. I think I should get some water. Wahoo! Why do I hate Sonic? Oh, it's not even a it's not even a joke. I just don't enjoy any of the games. It's it's not even like a character thing like, oh he's too annoying. I just don't enjoy the games. I actually, I bet I would like the Sonic movies relatively, especially the one with Tails in it, because Tails is adorable. But I just don't find any of the Sonic games fun. I've played a lot of them. Jules in that band, I did see that. It's a real shame. But I think that Booze, or however you pronounce that, those are still available. It's all the same garbage. It's all the same chemicals being pumped into your lungs until you turn into the literal embodiment of popcorn. Now there's a specific entrance that we gotta go. When will you learn? When will you learn the directions of consequences? <laughs> when will you learn? The Sonic fans! The Sonic fans have ruined it again! Sonic's not a hedgehog! He's a blue rat! When will you learn? When will you learn that his name is Eggman, not Robotnik? <laughs> oh no, my water stat, my water stat. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, dude. This is it. This is how I die. This is how I go. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe that this is my end. He died drinking salt water, doing what he loved. Oh, no, that's not the entrance. We have to turn the boat, but we need water more. Before we die, we can't turn. Oh my goodness. Okay. And I can only walk slow. No. No. Collision course. 10. 9. 6. 5. Turn. As much as you love Sonic, I feel like um, it's not a nostalgia thing. It's just, uh, it's just a mechanics thing. I just don't like the game mechanics. That's all that there is to it. I, I just don't like the uh, the slippery platforming of the classic games. Just feels a little too slippery for my liking, but it's just my opinion. Not like they're not like they're genuinely bad games. I I know that uh, lots of people like them. I just don't really like uh, how their platforming works. I like a very tight platformer myself. Oh, we've got the water. Dang, this music kind of busting. Oh, I just noticed that those trees were kind of thin looking. Wow! Alright, we gotta find the entrance, you guys. We gotta find the entrance. I think we're gonna poke we're gonna poke around in this building a little bit, and then I think we might uh Well this is nine. I think we could get in here. Like Crash Bandicoot? I haven't actually played Crash Bandicoot Xanic, but I watched my friend playing the the insane trilogy, and it looks it looks crazy hard. It looks crazy difficult. Gotta break every crate without dying. Dude, that is a that is a completionist nightmare. That game looks like it'll take you 80 hours to complete it, and it's not even that long of a game. Man, do you always spawn on the other side of the thing? But for now, we'll have to do with looking like a depressed possum. Are you talking about Sonic? <laughs> Sonic Adventure and Adventure 2 are the best Sonic games, though? Really? That's not what most fans say, as far as I can tell. Seems like everyone likes Sonic Mania. Sonic Mania is for the classics. For, for, the, for the classical Sonic enjoyer. Average Sonic Adventure 2 enjoyer. <laughs> Whoa, skateboards, dude! Average Sonic Mania enjoyer. Mmm, would you mind passing that Chardonnay? Ooh, I think I've smudged my monocle. Mmm, my mustache is looking extra twisty today. Mmm, how, how much does thou lift? Oh dear, one inch busted. That's why we're going slow. All right, shut it off. Shut off the engines. Drop the anchor. Yahoo! Wait, 
Don't go in there. The sharks. <laughs> no, the sharks after. Ow. My legs. My legs. Okay, we got to get ready, you guys. This is this is an intense, an intense area to break into, you guys. You got to look out. You got to look out. Nostalgia glasses wears. Oh, my. The drama continues. All right, you guys. It's time to get serious. Jedi, what's up? Jedi, it's me with my hair. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, yeah, just in time for the lick. Oops, he's back. Hooray. Oops. Just in time for the for the jazzy lick. Everybody, buy Mario Kart or pick up your Mario Kart copy and give it a lick. Thank you for the shout out. You guys, please check out my boyfriend. Please check out my boyfriend. Oi, oi, oi. He's my hot boyfriend. You should go follow him for Animal Crossing content. Poor Opsty. Whenever he shouts out me, he has to say, he plays, um, lots of games. Some of them very bad. However, he's a great guy. But for Ops, I can say, Okay, we can't, we can't turn it. We can't turn it while we're going. What do we need? We need two machetes. We need two machetes because there's a lot to kill in there if I remember properly. And we also need like three bottles of water. This is a this is an intense area that we're about to dip into. All right. Firstly, two machetes. And we're gonna need some food. We're gonna have to catch some fish. Yo! Oh, good. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Huh? You were watching the OT video the other day, and he was talking about how he doesn't play Fortnite. Then, <laughs> then responded going, you do now. with salty and even won. Oh, you did. Oh, you did. He's like, I don't play Fortnite, actually. And you're like, liar. Liar, I've seen it. Telling lies. No, papa. Ah, oh, put it back down. Oh no, what have I done? The chip, no, put it back. Put it back. Zelda, what's up? Zelda bits. Zelda for bits. I can't believe Zelda sold out like that. Oi. Zelda, we're getting ready. Love the hair. Can I see a zoom in? The undo button. <laughs> uh, okay, we got two machetes. Two machetes. One for you and one for me. Cook. Jesse. Jesse, we have to cook potatoes. And we also need the goo. Zagu. You shall see why, okay? First, we cook the goo. Then we make it into water bottles. Go to sleep. Robot okay. watching us. Hey! <laughs> Why would you knock me out of my cardboard boat? It's already not safe without you swinging the bat at it. Shuck. Are you gonna stay white? Oh, I don't know if that's a choice. I can't even tan at this point. Oh. <laughs> Good timing with the sound effect. <laughs> go, go. Oh, wait, whoops! <laughs> Wrong button! Wrong button! I meant to do this one. For no apparent reason. There, oh, you win my hair! I'm gonna keep it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep it as white. I, I like it like this. I like it like this. I think it looks cool. Alright, 
Dump that out. It looks good, even close up. Can you believe it? Yeah, I mean, the hair looks really nice. I think he did a great job. He did a great job and he b b bleached it so many times. Oh my God. And the hair is straight. I actually need to get a hair straightener because I kind of like, I like having this as an option, okay? I'm not going to wear it like this all the time, but I think that what my normal style, I want to be really gentle with the hair. But the normal style that I think I'm going to do is a ponytail, a low ponytail with like bangs hanging off. That's what I think the standard one's going to be. Like two, like part in the middle, two, two little hangies, two little, two little chandeliers. And then in the back, a bun. I think that that is gonna be the, the coolest. And I'm probably gonna shave my beard entirely off tonight, or I'm gonna shave it down to like a one, and we'll see if we like stubble better. I know that I know that this stubble looks pretty good, but I don't know. I don't know, you guys. Super short beard or no beard are both good options. I would love to. What'd you say? What'd you say? Go hook? <laughs> you gonna keep it straight? The, the hair. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I think, uh, no, I, I won't keep it straight all the time, Dai. It won't be straight all the time because I wanna, I wanna let it have some volume every now and again. But I think for right now, straight might be a better idea. Might, might might be easier at the moment because my poor hair is so exhausted. If it starts getting healthy again and gets some good volume, then I will uh I'll let it be wavy. Cause I got some I got some pretty wavy hair. The contrast of wet red to white is cool, but I'm sure you'll get anime what? <laughs> get anime girl hair. <laughs> I think it'll look good. Whack! Beat the crap out of him. Heck yeah. No current plans yet. We'd be back in Dallas in the next seven weeks. Seven weeks is a long time. Who knows? Who knows? We'll have to see. You know, these, these things, you never know until they happen. And then you're like, whoa, never expected that. Let's make sure that you use some heat protection if you're gonna be straightening your hair a lot. Yeah, I got, I got an argon oil spray that I'll use. It's supposed to be a good heat protectant. I always, I always put argon hair, argon oil on my hair whenever I use a blow dryer. And I only blow dry it on medium as well. The only thing that I'll have to figure out is what my schedule will be for conditioning and washing. I'm guessing that I should just like let my hair exist for a little bit. Should I just like leave it alone for like a few days or something? Or like a week? Just like let oil get back into it? Or should I wash it like really fast to try to like clean it? Seems like I should just leave it alone for a bit. Poor hair. Poor hair has been working so hard. Working so hard, Mr. Frodo. Oh, Mr. Frodo, you've been working too hard. Let me massage your legs, Mr. Frodo. They're all crooked and broken. Okay. Now we make another water bottle. Another water bottle. You wash your hair once a week. Natural oil is good. Wait. Admit it. Do you have greasy hair? <laughs> All right, there we go. We got three water bottles. We're not gonna bring Lebo. Lebo is not necessary for where we're going. Makes it sound like we're gonna die. Where we're going, you don't need no water. Your hair dry though? Yeah, my hair is not that dry. My hair is coarse and kind of mid. It's not very oily. It's not super oily, but it's not super dry either. I guess it depends on the time of season, don't it? Um, you give your hair an oil mask after serious bleaching oil mask. I bought some more expensive shampoo that has keratin in it, I think. Is that is that what it would be? Keratin. It's got like keratin and green green tea, I think. And then the deep conditioner is supposed it has like coconut and argon and something else. 
And it's conditioner that you can like leave in for 15 minutes with a hair cover on or something and like let it get warm. Champion, what's up? Oi, oi, carrot tin. <laughs> carrot tin face mask. Boop, fix boat, fix boat. All right, we're almost ready for our expedition. Just need to fill up our water. Fill up water. Now we have potato. Healing salve might be a good idea to bring. I think I'll leave the crummy. Crummy salve stays. Have to bring the machete. Get rid of all this stuff for now. We'll just dump it in here and clean it up later. Uh, vine goo goes in here. We we do need to bring our air, our air canister because we'll need it. And I think you need a flashlight in there. I can't quite remember, but that's plenty of oxygen. We got that, we got the food. We need more food though. I thought that I was just cooking. Did we just eat all the shark meat? There is food in there. I think I didn't ever starve while I went in there. I only, I only ran out of water. Oh, you want to say hi? Cause it's been forever since I saw pretty hair. Hey, thanks for jumping in. It was good to see you Zelda bits. Much love. And Gene Fruits, thanks for chilling with us. Get some rest. Hit the hay. Oi, oi. Thanks for chilling with us. Zelda, Gene Fruits. Have a wonderful rest of your night. Oi, oi. Much love. Thanks for chilling. Um, you said, I would say once a week. Could always put it up at night so it stays away from the oils on your face. Mmm. I don't want to leave my hair up at night. Because that's going to that's gonna put unnecessary strain on it. Oh, there's bugs in here. Gross. I want to stand here for a second because I'm going to... Um, I'm going to real quick grab some water, you guys. I've got to grab some water, okay? So y'all just chill here and look out for Brucey for me, all right? I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Don't y'all go anywhere. Don't you go anywhere or else. Right, I guzzled the water. Nobody left, right? Because I have an important question. Important question. What's the cutest dog breed? I'm not a dog person, and I'm kind of wondering what people think. Because I think that people's, people's view on dogs differ from mine, but it seems like my opinion shouldn't matter since I don't like dogs that much. But what's the, what's the cutest dog breed? Hey, speaking of dogs! Some raft slash ocean slash beach puns for you. Celebrate good tides. Things are sailed on what they seem. Seaside life sure is perfect. Life is better in sandals. That's one opinion I will never flip flop on. Going to the beach? Please avoid peer pressure. See you later. Anyway, oh, oh, I'll make this question even harder. It can't be a dog that you've ever owned. Can't be a dog that you've ever owned. What's the cutest dog that you've never owned? <laughs> ah, rats! Oh, stab, stab. All right, there we go, free meat. We can technically eat this, but we're not supposed to because it'll, it'll make us thirsty. 
It'll make us thirsty. There we go. Border Collie is actually super cute. I actually do like Border Collies. You know what? I, t I rescind my opinion. I like dogs. I forgot about Border Collies. Border Collies are really smart and really cute and really fluffy. And that covers all of my uh, pet features that have to be included. Has to be cute, fluffy, and it has to be... It, I, it has to jive. Like, its personality needs to jive with mine. Like, it doesn't have to be smart, but... But Border Collie's smart. Okay, this is the worst part of the game. So you have to you have to power this thing up and then you have to aim at the you have to aim at the buttons to press them. We've got one generator part. How how many do we need? You like poodles, Demolion? I thought that poodles were evil. Aren't poodles evil? I thought that poodles were like crazy and they'll bite you and stuff. Is that just bad poodle owners? I mean, I know that there's like no mean dog breeds, but I've heard that poodles are like more likely, maybe. There we go. Okay, we're gonna schmooze through here. A Norwich Terrier. I've liked all the terriers that I've seen, but I don't think I know that specific one. Terrier's cute. Oh, I just used my spear. Actually, that was kind of smart. We got the spear out of the way. Now we can use a good weapon. Snag that. We'll go to the kitchen. Cook up some grub. Any of y'all hungry? I'll, I'll make y'all some dinner. Okay, welcome to the canteen, everybody. You know, pick a seat. There's plenty of chairs. Just don't take the one that's taken by this rat. Just don't sit next to him. He likes his space. Y'all can, uh, yeah, just pick up a seat, and I'll and I'll cook y'all up some grub. Let me let me hop into the kitchen, real quick. We don't have a lot of ingredients. It's mostly rotten rat meat. That's the only that's the only food we got right now. Actually, come to come to find out, it's only called raw meat. It says meat tastes better when cooked. Hmm. I mean, to a certain extent. I wonder if I'd rather eat a raw steak than a. I guess I would eat a well done steak before I ate a raw steak, because you would die. But I do like I do like a, a semi rare steak. What what is it called? Maybe I order my steak. Medium rare, I think. Medium rare is good. Very juicy. I came from a family where we like burn our steaks. My mom would like burn the steaks, and so would my dad. They would both burn our steaks, and they were they're well done people. They're well done people, and that's the only way that I ate steaks forever. And then we went to Fogo de Chon, which is a uh, Brazilian. It's a Brazilian steakhouse, and they had some, like, really rare meats. And I was like, whoa, wait a minute, blood tastes delicious. Wait a minute. I love blood. Oh, Drooby's here! Hey, what's up, yo? Shouts out to Drooby, my fellow, my fellow harvester. Bringing in that sussy harvest. We got the, we got the harvest leader, Opsty, here. And we got Drooby. Head, head harvester. Then we have me, assistant co-harvester. And then we also have the wizard harvester. Rim mage. Oi, Drooby, what's up? Yeah, the hair, it's here. The beard's coming off tonight. The beard's coming off tonight. May can we make a poll for beard trim or beard remove? Beard, maybe beard nuke and beard trim. Those are the two options. Beard nuke or beard trim. I'm honestly fine with either one. Hey, what's up, Flatly Written? It's me, 2B, from the popular series Near Automata. From the Near series. Just need my blindfold. My blindfold and a gun or whatever weapon they use. Have you ever had blue steak? I have not. That sounds dangerous. Sounds dangerous, die. How many how many things do we have? Sunzi, where are you? Hello? Near Atoma Turtle to <laughs> oh, wait, what? <laughs> Near Otto Mer Merle Merlta. Near Atoma Merlta. <laughs> Perfect. I couldn't have said it better myself. 
You're on mobile. You need an adult mod. Beardly? You guys, what's it gonna be? Beard go bye-bye? Beard go bye-bye or beard goes small, small? Y'all decide. I'm literally gonna cut it tonight and I do not care which way it goes. What does Opes think? I'm gonna hang out with Opes tonight, I think, so... It's true. He'll have veto power. He'll have veto power. How about that? But you guys vote for what y'all want, all right? Listen, vote with your heart. Assume that... Assume that Opes is okay with everything. Okay, this is the worst part of the game. Let's be honest. Uh... Okay, I'm just gonna start moving all these boxes. Just ignore this part of the game, you guys. It's horrible. You have to aim with your you aim with your mouse and press buttons. It's, it's really, really bad. But the exit's over there, so I need to move this there. You can see the tape on top of here. You can see the tape on top. That tells me that there's a passageway through it. So we're trying to get over to that door over there. Door over there. And keep in mind, beards, beards grow fast. So you can't really make a wrong, a wrong answer. Beard trim or no, no wrong answers. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. See what I'm saying? You see how long this takes? And I think that this is the, this is the like speedy route that I'm taking. This is after experience. Okay, I think that we can craft an exit now. Oh boy. I think I'm doing this in the most efficient manner. It's kinda hard to tell. Okay. <laughs> Beep, bop, boop. Beep bop. Best gameplay ever. Game of the year. 2022. Wow, I cannot believe that my favorite game won game of the year two years in a row. I feel like that should be against the rules. Oh, mamma mia. Here we go again. We can't move these out, can we? No, nope. we've, we've already extended it as far as we can go. We're already cheesing this maximum cheese. Trim? Trim? Did you vote? Oops, did you vote? It's reminding you of Portal? Oh my gosh, how dare you speak poorly of Portal like that. Portal is leagues better than this game. I'm so sorry. Oh, you voted! What did you vote? There we go. What did, what did you vote, Oops? Well, there we go. We got a water pipe diagnostic. Oh! Hello? Oh, it's a beast. I should have put on my flashlight. It's a personal question, sir. Yeah, and I'm a personal guy. Listen, I'm personable. Are you saying you don't trust? You don't trust me? Who do you trust then? Oh my goodness. I wouldn't want to be associated with this man. Oh my goodness. Oops, you gotta, you gotta answer me. Riddle me this. Riddle me this, Batman. What did you vote? Here we go. Whoa! Oh yeah, now we do Oh, oh no. Oh no, I forgot about this part. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, we flooded it. <laughs> you voted trim? Okay, it's trim then. I was, if you had voted, if you had voted full cut, then I would have done full cut because your vote counts for twice. Ah, your vote counts for two. Oh, we need to go to the plantation. We're underwater. It even works underwater. Oh, this is the place that we're supposed to go. This is why you raise the water so you can hop on this little ladder here, go to the plantation and eat the bananas. Mmm, banana. This is a shortcut that we just opened? Yeah. Shortcut, that was one of the locked doors that we encountered earlier. So glad I already know how to do this part. Bingo! Bingo, does it? There's uh, bananas and strawberries. You guys, if you could only eat... If if strawberries or bananas were the only... 
were the only fruit that you could eat, which one would it be? Which one's better? Bananas or strawberries? You know, honestly... Honestly, trim beard's probably the best idea. Because we can always just cut off more. We can always just cut off more. Oh, shoot. The electric area. Also, I'm taking off my flashlight. <gasps> Frick! Don't throw it. Strawberries, because you can eat them unlimited. What? Is there a limit to your banana eating? You can only eat a banana a day. <laughs> no! That's not true. It's just the minimum of a banana a day to keep the doctor away. That's that's a minimum number, not a maximum number. Only what? Because then it would be called only a banana a day to keep the doctor away. Because that makes it sound like you're limiting it. Oh yeah, good thing that we brought this axe, because you need it for these little banana trees. Even if Ope's vote counted twice and he voted nuke, that still wouldn't have won. That's still only one more vote. Ope's is worth four people. <laughs> Ope's is worth four people? That's because Ope's has four hearts. That's right. You heard it here first. Ope's has an unusual circulatory system. Oh! Almost electrocuted myself. This is like that part of amnesia. Y'all remember that? Strawberries taste good with chocolate and sugar. Ooh. Strawberries are already so sweet, though. Quinn Jester's going... Going for broke with the strawberry department. But I totally agree. Strawberries are way better than bananas. Bananas can be get put into bread, and that's about it. The berry or the false fruit? <laughs> the false fruit? It's a false friend. Well, how is a banana a false fruit? Bananas are so good with chocolate, are they? Are they? Can we get a can we get a second opinion on the banana chocolate situation? Lately, I've been into green bananas. You're into green bananas, eh? Hard bananas, eh? Unripe bananas, eh? Suspicious. Suspicious. That can't be good for you. That can't be good for you. Turn that off. Oh! Wait, are we supposed to go through here? Bananas are berries? No, they're not. Bananas are not berries. That doesn't make any sense. Next thing you're going to be telling me is that tomatoes belong in a fruit salad. I don't believe any of it. Your mom would always eat bananas and strawberries with chocolate. <gasps> That's cheating! You can't have bananas and strawberries. <laughs> Look at this. Wait, what? Why did we need a... Wait, why did we need the... The duct tape down here? Is there more ducts to tape? Bananas are one of the most popular fruits in the world. They're full of important nutrients. But eating too much can cause more harm than good. Too much of any food can contribute to weight gain and nutrient deficiencies. One or two bananas today a day is considered a moderate intake. Yeah, but that's everything. That's everything. Look, if you drink too much water, you'll die. And water is pretty good as far as I'm concerned. Requires three tape. Do I have to go get tape from the rest of the town? Huh, maybe, maybe we do have to get tape from town. But I, I wonder what's, surface seems like the best place to go. Why would we want to go anywhere but the surface? Also, we're gonna need food. We're gonna need food, I'm starving. I'm starving, Marvin. Poor Marvin is starving again. He's eating all the strawberries. Mmm, strawberries for lunch. Mr. Frodo. We're nearly through our strawberry stash. Kill it. Kill it. You can't dodge it. You might as well kill it. Oh, we got a key card. Shh, I'm breaking the fruit law. <gasps> the fruit law? There's laws? <laughs> Are you telling me that there's laws? Oh, no. Nope, nobody told me about the laws when I got my fruit license. 
Dude, my license to fruit's gonna get revoked, man. Oh, Robert. Maybe we can learn how to battle them. Sudsbot's going down. Killed one Sudsbot. I'll kill another. Oh! You forgot radios are <laughs> that bananas are radioactive? <laughs> what? They're not that radioactive. Oh! That robot almost got me. How am I supposed to kill that thing? Oh, if only we brought our arrows. <laughs> if only I hadn't thrown out the one thing that we needed. Arrows. Can we survive a hit now? If we die, we lose everything in our pocket. We lose everything in our pocket and it can't be recovered. It doesn't get dropped in a b -b -b backpack. This music doesn't quite match the city. There should be like some kind of... Oh boy. See, this game is so strange. Look what you can do now. You can use key cards to enter buildings and they have interiors. That's right. There's interiors to these buildings with things to loot. But it's but it's just crafting materials that you can get in the ocean. They're, they're almost all just the same crafting items that you can get in the ocean. It's the same copy-paste environment like almost every one of these houses. Who designed this part of the game? I don't understand. I don't know why this why this is part of the game. Yeah, but there are but there are special coins that you can get in every one of these like interiors and the special coins allow you to buy items that you can't get otherwise so it's like it's a necessary part of the game if you want to make your boat look good it's kind of kind of weird kind of weird this is there not a single coin where are the coins where are the god dang coins i'm looking for a picture of a god dang hot dog i was looking for a god dang hot dog do I look like I know what a JPEG is? JPEGY! There's no coins! Oh, a crate. It had explosive powder in it. Ooh. Can we get rid of any of the items that we have? Mm. Oh, we can eat this. We can eat this patat. Mmm. Potato. Potato lunch. They're these are both explosive powders. You can make. You can make, um, fireworks out of those, right? I don't think we have them research, though. Ashamedly. Ashamedly, no research has been done on the meta. And I feel like I'm being dumb. Is there not a single coin in here? The coins are normally pretty obvious. But we used our one key card. We used our one key card to get in this building, and I can't even get a coin. I wanted to show y'all off the spending machines but I got unlucky it looks like we don't get anything it's too bad next time next time do I look like I know what a JPEG is I just want a picture of a god dang hot dog <laughs> god dang did we get two key cards no we never did kill that other robot we found a game that you used to love as a kid on Steam and it's on sale for four dollars which game is it What's the game, Quinn? You gotta tell me. You gotta tell me, cause I gotta know. Oh my god, every time did... Oh, I got the strats down now. Ow! Never mind, never mind! Oh! Oh! We got him! Nice, we almost died. Oh my gosh, that was risky. Look, I can see an arrow in here. Did we pick one up? We did. We picked up an extra arrow. All right, key card. We're going in. Oh, what? There's plastic in the lobby? In the lobby, no less. This one's only got one floor. Dragon's Dogma. I've heard of that. I've heard of that. I've seen that about. It's on Steam. Mm, everything's on Steam. I'm, I'm going to have to go shopping later. Maybe, maybe we'll search a couple more floors here, and maybe we'll go shopping for a game for tomorrow. Maybe we'll go shopping for tomorrow's game. We might play some more raft at some point, but... Oh, this is a watermelon. We gotta have that. We gotta have the watermelon. Can't go without it. 
Yum, yum, yum. We need a coin, though. I want to get a coin. Oh, there's one. A token. Pardon. Token. It's the token currency. It's in every game. Is this a parkour one? Yeah, there's parkour in this game, of course. Of course, why would you why would you think otherwise? They put everything in this game. Whenever whenever the game developers were asked what they wanted to put in the game, they said, um, do we have to choose? Can we just put everything in here? They were like, we don't see why not. What the heck? How do you survive this? to jump off onto the other zip line oh my god what you can survive that that was amazing <laughs> this this fall damage ain't nothing it ain't nothing okay this is all you see you can buy a grand piano in here oh you can buy food but not for the money that i have i only have one token you can buy fancy plants by paintings. It's pretty sweet. Well, we made it to the city, you guys, and we got to hang out, and I showed y'all, I showed you the hair. I showed you my hair, okay? It was super late today. I'm sorry. Sorry for being late. My hair, my hair styling took way longer than expected. But at least we got to hang out for a bit. We got to hang out, but let's, uh, let's save here. And we can go check out, we'll check out the Steam store really quick. Bingo! Bingo! We'll set this to not raft. Set it to just chatting. Yeah, let's let's see if we if a game like sticks out to us. Is there any good games that I should look at, you guys? Any any spicy? De oh, we can just look on the main page. Company. So what do you want in the game? Game developers. Yes. Raft two. Listen. Raft. <laughs> raft one was just released. Open world games, city settlement games, story rich, anime, strategic, atmospheric, visual novels, horror games. Mm. Maybe maybe we should buy a... What is this Animal Crossing looking game with guns in it? <laughs> New world. This is tempting, but I think that they have like progression issues that they never solved. And it, and it still is like kind of a broken, unfinished game. I want to touch my scalp so much, but I have to stop myself... Don't touch. I need to keep streaming until I stop feeling like touching my scalp. <laughs> Cook, serve, delicious. Two. Mmm. You want Animal Crossing with guns? Just look at this. Look at the visual design on this game. Explore nature. Shoot stuff. It won't let me click on it. Long winter. I want... Okay, there we go. Yeah, look. Oh, the houses are cute. It's kind of cute. It's like a survival game. It's actually kind of, it's actually kind of adorable. Now I want this game. <laughs> Fish, farm, craft, gather, cook, loot, or steal from other players. So it's, so it's, uh, it's rust. It's rust, but it looks better. It's got achievements in it already. Oh boy. Terrible anti-cheat. That's not too surprising. It is an early access, right? I guess for private servers, it wouldn't be too bad. Hmm. I'll keep an eye on this. I, I didn't actually know that that could like possibly be good. I'll keep that in mind. One game you're excited to play that's been on Salty Stream is Stray. The Quarry. I've, I've had a lot of friends that played The Quarry. What is it about? $60? Dude, there's no way it's worth $60. No no chance. No shot. No horror. Let me. Okay. Hot take. No horror game is worth $60. Hot take. No horror game. Not a single one. They're all too short. Maybe Alien Isolation. Okay, maybe Alien Isolation. How long could this game possibly be? Besides, this just looks like. Oh, wait. Look at all these kids. Look at all these kids, though. See all these children in this game? You know what this is? Stranger Things. <laughs> Stranger Things, the, the game. 
That's what I'm thinking. Ahsoka, what's up? How are you doing? Oi, oi! You made it to the end of the stream. Oh, yes. 80s throwback characters. Oh, great. It's horror game with 80s vibes. It's Stranger Things. And what's the other one? Pennywise? Stranger Things slash... What, what's it called? I forget. I forget the other thing. Pennywise the Clown. Um, it's dead poly. This is all. Uh, this all looks like MMO stuff. Why are they suggesting it? It. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it. Oh yeah, we should double check the wish list real quick. Let's. Uh, Deep Rock Galactic looks fun. Code Vein. Do I have? Do I have the near game? Hitman Three. That's on my wish list. Let me just remove that. Build a zoo looks cute. Lego Builder's journey is a little expensive, even still. One more island. Sunhaven is not on sale. Ghosts and Goblins Resurrection. $20 for this game still doesn't seem fair. It still doesn't seem right. Let's build a zoo looks super cute, Ahsoka. And so does this uh, Shovel Knight Pocket Dungeon. Layers of Fear is not on sale. Flotsam still not done. This is a VR game. I, I should probably just remove this. I don't play that much VR anymore. Deep Rock Galactic. That's tempting. I'll think about it. I'll think about Code Vein too. Um, hmm. Any games that have been suggested by somebody that I can think of? Fighting games? No, thank you. Kaiju Princess. I'm not. I am not scrolling over any anime pictures. Okay. Because you never know. With with Steam now, they allow anything on this platform, and I'm gonna get banned. Satisfactory's on sale. Ooh, but that's that's probably an offline game right now. A major Steam sale? Yeah, the summer sale. You love how the lighting makes it look like I have purple in my hair? Oh yeah 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 yeah. The uh, that's that's one of my lights over there in the corner. I thought that that was kind of cool. Since the hair is white, I can kind of like cast any color onto it. Oh, what about... There's no way that V Rising is on sale. No, no shot. What? It's in early access, and it was released. It's in early access. It was released on the 17th of May, and it's and it's on sale. Even 10% off is crazy, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna buy this game. My friends have been playing this game. Wait, what? There's DLC already? What? How's there DLC? It's an early access game. What the heck? 27 different gargoyle statues? What? They're selling DLC in an early access game? This is a new low, you guys. We've sunk to a new low. Just selling add-on content to a game that's not even done. Yikes. But V Rising's still good. Still good. It looks like lots of fun. My friends my friends have been playing it. I've got two different groups of friends that have been playing it. So I'll, I'll have to grab that. You said <laughs> Nothing with an anime picture is a pretty good rule for any website. If you see somebody on YouTube that made a comment that you disagree with, just look at their profile picture. If it's an anime character, then it's not worth arguing with them. Just just in case. Potion Permit. Oh, this is the game that Rimage was playing. I didn't really watch too much of it because I was starving and I had to get some food. Didn't really look like my kind of game, I don't think. Diagnose people's ailments? No, 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 no. I'm more of a killing guy, not a saving life kind of guy. If any, if I can't poison the people that I'm supposed to be helping, then I, I just can't play it. Ooh, Inscription looks fun. That's that's supposed to be a scary game. Okay, let's let's look at horror games for a minute, you guys. Let's see if, let's see what what do you think is the scariest game? What's the scariest game that you've ever seen, or you've ever played? Because I legitimately have been having trouble scaring myself recently. Be Rising's a horror game. What? Okay, we need it. Wait, what? I clicked on horror. Sekiro is a horror game. 
Half-Life Alex is a horror game. You don't get scared by games. See, that's I think that's my problem. You think Dead Space is scary? Dead Space is definitely jump scary. Like, like aliens are jumping out of boxes and stuff. That is true. But it's one of those games that you can just tune it out. And you can just be like, okay, you know that there's there's going to be another monster in the next container. You know, you could just expect it. You can expect around every corner. Alien Isolation. I already own that game, Quinn. I haven't played it recently, but that did scare the bejeebus out of me when I was a kid. Or when I was younger, anyway. That game did, did frighten me. Subnautica uh, frightened me a couple of times, too. Soma! I have that game, too! Ooh, we're gonna play Soma this, this Halloween. This Halloween, we're gonna play Soma. We're gonna play Luigi's Mansion, and we're gonna play Soma. That's, that's for sure. That's for sure. Those are, those are promised. Those are locked in. Locked in for gameplay. See, I already own Soma. I'm ready to go with that. Code Vein is considered a horror game? It's considered a horror game like, um... Like that Dark Souls Lovecraft game is considered. Bloodborne. Yeah, it's horror like Bloodborne is horror. Help Wanted? What's, what's this again? I, I've, I have lost track of how many Five Nights at Freddy's games there are now. This Five Nights at Freddy 1, 2, 3, 4. I think this one is the big bundle of all the games put together, or is this the VR one? Yeah, this is the... Okay, this is the first three games in VR. Killer Five... Original mini games. Five Nights at Freddy's Experiences. How many, though? From front, Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, Foxy, Springtrap... Mangle, Funtime Foxy, and Circus Baby. So Circus Baby's in number two. And the Mangle's in number two? Is this just one and two? Oh, it says scenes have been remade from one, two, three, four, and sister location. Whoa! Holy moly! These are all the, the games that Scott actually worked on, right? Though I don't think Scott made this game. I think that Scott... Uh, just just got other people to do it in some other engine because obviously whatever he was using is not good enough for VR. Never finished Village. That that's something that I'd like to play. Maybe maybe we play Village during uh, Halloween. Maybe that's a, that's a maybe. That one's not locked in, you guys. That one's not locked in. That's not surefire. Prey is pretty spooky. Mmm. Village good. The only problem is that Village really chows down on my computer. It'd be nice if I could get Village on... Maybe I'll get it on PS5 so that we can play it. I, I bet it'll be cheap by Halloween time. I think I own Prey. Yeah, this, this game did look a little spooky. It doesn't look scary, but it looks spooky. This is made by the... Ar this is made by Arcane, right? It's by Arcane Studios. I can I can tell by the style alone. Same people that made Dishonored. Yeah. Oh, this looks good. I, I think I own this on PS4. Prey look good. Villager noms on your computer? Nom 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 nom. Are you a villager now? Villager says... <laughs> Survival games. I want to look at... Uh, is Rust on... Is Rust on sale? Rust never goes on sale for much. It's so expensive. It's 50% off, but it's still $20. $20 for this? $20 for for man pick up rock? Get shot by random big server? I don't know. It's not horror, but there's killing and stealth. It's called Thief. Oh yeah, I do have that game. The the one that was released in 2014. Gabatron. Yeah, thief. I actually enjoyed it a fair bit, but it's been a oops, the spelling. It's it's been a while since I played it. It's only three dollars. Yeah, it has some weird Lovecraftian things that go on, and there's some like there's some times that you peek in like a little doorknob, and then something will jump out in front of you and scare you. Or there's like a big haunted uh, there's this haunted hospital that you go into, and then there's like. 
all sorts of noises that go on. It's kind of spooky. It's kind of spooky. I, I did enjoy it, but I was a kid. <gasps> it's Ripsy! Ripsy! You like my hair? My hair! It's This poor hair is so destroyed right now. I feel so sorry for my scalp and my hair. I feel so bad. It got bleached three times. Three times and then died. And then it died. Oi! Can we get a shout out for Ripsy? Super cute VTuber. Super cute VTuber. They have a cute voice and a cute avatar. And they play good games. Oi, oi. You should go say hi to Ripsy. And make sure that you're extra sassy. Because they really respond to that. If you don't type every message with this kind of thinking in your brain. If you're not envisioning your words like this. Then I don't think that you're quite chatting correctly. Death loop looks fun. But it's a little expensive right now. Oh, you were working on art last time. Oh. People, people, people. Elden Ring. Already own that. Oh, my God. Uh, oh, my God. Uh, I... You guys, I don't know if this is a good idea. I don't think that I should... Maybe I should surprise y'all tomorrow. Maybe I should surprise y'all with a new game. As a gift. As a gift from the gods. The gods have this... The, the gods have given us a gift. We cannot deny what the gods have given. But that means that I have to come up with something smart. That means I have to be clever. Caligula. That sounds like a bad idea. Anything involving Caligula is probably not good for the stream. Cute game called Little Witch in the Woods. That sounds bad. Little Witch in the Woods? Don't witches get burnt in games right now? Little witch in the woods. Aww. I like the art. I like the art. It does look like a cute game. It's early access, though. This does look like a cute game. Look at that. You can be a little witch. And your mom is Satan. Your mom is a... <laughs> I like that. I love that animation. With her eyes. That's so cute. That's so derpy. Do you see her eyes going back and forth? Aww. This would be very this would be very inspiring. Very inspiring for my pixel art that I've been doing. I love the crooked eyes on this character. That adds so much so much character just to walking. Oh god. Killed Yeah. This game looks boring, but very cute. That's cute. Uh, ba 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 ba. Yeah, I need maybe maybe I can ask. What's a really hard game to complete? What's a difficult game that doesn't rely too much on difficult combat? Like not Souls like. What's a game that's not not Souls like but is extremely difficult? I already have Jump King. I already have getting over it. Is there another game that's like just really, really hard to beat? I think I have Human Fall Flat and I don't think I've beaten it yet. I do have Human Fall Flat. That's good. Hades is great, Quinn. I love Hades. I love Hades. I've played it like 70 hours or something. We've gotten the like true ending. I haven't 100%ed it. I haven't gotten everything and I haven't even gotten like some of the like first end game content but i i got like the true ending sort of but it's it's very fun i love hades hades is also really fun because they scaled down the difficulty which i think makes it way more i think it makes it way more accessible to more people which is a good idea because lots of people just miss out on these hard games because they're just like i can't play dark souls Ooh, devil may cry has some hard games in there right haven't played Hades in a while. That's true, but I mean, if I was doing Hades runs, that's all that they would be. They would just be runs. Unless we wanted to restart. Look at that. You could be a little witch and your mom is Satan. It's true. 
That's just, that's just true. That's not even... You don't even have to quote that. Everyone would believe you. Battlefield. That's... See, that's what... That's where my next stream art goes. If I play Battlefield. See, there's not enough streamers playing Battlefield 2042. Mostly negative. Oh! It's got 28%! Yo! 100,000 reviews and it's 28%! Dude! God! That's one of the worst scores I've ever seen. Wow! That's so bad. Whoops! <laughs> Ori's so good. Frustrating but good. Yeah, we completed the first one. And we also sped run the first one. And, uh, an well, we didn't get every achievement, did we? No, I, th I think that we didn't get every achievement of Ori. Ori in the Blind Forest Definitive Edition? No, we didn't. There, there's another few different runs in here. There's some more, there's some more specialty things that you gotta do, like kill 50 enemies with light burst. Bash enemies without touching the ground. That one's just kind of tricky. You have to do that in a specific spot. Deadly dash. Yeah, complete the game in one life difficulty. That's the thing that we didn't do. And we didn't do the speed run. I thought that we had done a speed run. No, but we did it uh, abilityless, and we did it without dying. Wait. Complete the whole game without dying. No, we didn't do that. No, I don't have that one. That confused me. No, we haven't done that. Oh, dude, I haven't beaten Celeste. Holy crap. Hey, what's up? How are you doing? Is that, uh... Ooh, how do I say your name? Is that Yulin? Yulin Zwerg? Oi, what's up? Thank you so much. I just got the hair done today, and it is kind of itchy. I'm trying to ignore it. I'm doing my best. Oh, Taka, thank you again for the raid. And uh, much studying in the morning. Yes, get some rest. Get some rest. Indeed, indeed, indeed. Get some rest. We will see you later. Nighty night, Taka. You made it to the end anyway. We're just doing a little bit of shopping, and then we'll find somebody to raid. I just wanted to hang out with y'all, uh, even though I was late. Oh, thank you for the follow. Yo, welcome to the party. We'll be back tomorrow with some more games. I've been trying to play games like... Uh, Almost every day of the week. I think I'm going to take Sundays and Wednesdays off. That's that's going to be the plan for now. Sundays and Wednesdays are definitely off. But yeah, welcome to the party. Trying to trying to look at some cheapo games that are around here. Got any suggestions for good games? You said um, you tried to beat it without, without dying, but yeah, I, I didn't do it. Not that I couldn't do it. I just didn't do it. Another game called F.E. It's pretty neat. Is that the only description of this game is it's pretty neat? Fe? I don't even think that's coming up. Oh. Yeah, I can see it's got a little Ori vibes going on here. A little Ori. You played Outer Wilds? That game looks, uh, that doesn't look like a stream game. Oh wait! Oh, this is this is the game that uh, Darren was playing. This looks interesting, but I'm not sure if this is a stream a stream game. Looks like it might be a little a little slow, a little slow. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'll 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 sample it. I'll sample it. I'll take a little I'll take a little nibble and we'll see. <laughs> I don't know if it's your vibe, but Turnip Boy, that's so good. Postachio. That game is so good. I think that they added more content to it. I bought it the day that it came out and we streamed it that day. It was very funny. You've committed tax evasion. <laughs> Mayor Onion, what do you mean what? You've committed tax evasion. This, uh, this script was the best part of this game. Very funny. Wanna challenge my limitless line? Head on in when you're ready. Yeah, there is there is a challenge mode that they made that I haven't played, but it is the script of the main story is so silly. It made me laugh a bunch. It's legitimately probably one of the funniest games I've ever played. With Rainbow Billy, is that a 
Are you talking about Rainbow Siege? <laughs> Rainbow Billy. What the heck is this? Oh, this looks like uh, this looks like an Adventure Time adjacent show, or like um, this. What does this remind me of? This reminds me of a Cartoon Network show. That character design, Billy. Billy themselves looks like a specific character. I can't. I can't put my finger on it. It kind of reminds me of Flapjack. Kind of reminds me a little bit of Flapjack. Maybe just the hair and the freckles, but the hair's the wrong color. Yeah, Gabe Tron. That's what I was thinking. It does. It does remind me of Flapjack. Might. Might be the eyes. Is this just a difficult platformer? You know, I do love platformers, but this one's like, this is isometric. Oh, the point of view looks really weird. And they're all flat? What the heck? How many, how many modes of gameplay do you want in this game? All of them. We'll have platforming, boss fights, puzzles. It'll be 2D, it'll be 3D. It'll have turn-based combat and <laughs> combat. Why? Why turn-based combat? It's the worst, it's the worst game mode ever. It's the worst kind of combat, turn-based. Look at it, it's 3D. And then it's 2D. This game looks all over the place, but kind of cool. Oh, Drex, welcome back. How do you how do you know about this game, Alchemic? How do you know about this game? It only has 43 reviews. Oh, you want it. Did you see somebody play this? It looks pretty interesting. Definitely, definitely you keep an eye on it. You watch someone play it. Mm. Well, whenever you buy it and play it, tell me how it is, because it looks janky AF. <laughs> Just, I only say that because it's got so many elements, so many different types of gameplay. I can't imagine that it's that well, um, that it's that well, like, polished. Maybe it is. Maybe, maybe they're just really good at designing games, but it immediately makes me think, there's no way that all of this is fun. There's no way that, that the core gameplay is going to be fun, because it'll be all over the place. This is the Crash games. I don't think I want to stream the Crash games, though. Mm. It's Finnick from the forest. The who? Hey, yo, Darren. I was I just mentioned you a little bit ago. Yo, what's up, Darren? What hair? Look at this. I'm Kenny the White. Let me let me uh let me teleport into my purple room. I don't have a green room here because I'm not like a like an artist that's about to go on stage, but here's my purple room. Check out this hair. I kind of got some Witcher-ish vibes. A little bit. A little bit. Darren, what's up, my friend? We're just looking at games. You got any suggestions? I've got 16 bucks on the account, and I want to buy a game. I want to buy a game, but I might just continue shopping tonight. The Teacup Cat. I know, it's so cute. Jackson, that was that was made by my friend. Um, haven't seen them in a little while. Something coffee, Eerie Coffee. Eerie Coffee made that, it's very adorable. I love that baby. Hmm, yeah. Just trying to, just just thought that we'd poke around in here. See if anybody suggests something. Oh, the open world icon. Open world is Fennec? Open world icon? Yo, this music sounds like an anime. Sounds like an open, uh, an anime closing. Wait, Finnick from the forest. Ooh, I wanna, I wanna watch. I wanna play the forest. Oh my god, I need to buy. I have to buy. I have to buy V Rising. That one's getting bought. That one doesn't count as the 16 bucks. Ever play Outer Wilds? That's literally, a, people have already mentioned that. What the heck? Why does everybody like Outer Wilds so much? It's 
so good about this game. I, I saw you play it a little bit. It looked kind of relaxing, right? You kind of look kind of relaxing, like a real open world experience. Wasn't this the game that you were playing where like there was sand that was rising? Oh, I also already own it. Oh shucks, Alchemic bought it for me. <laughs> Alchemic bought it for me. I didn't buy this game. Yeah, this game looks interesting. It just doesn't look like a stream game to me. A lot of folks say it's their top game ever. What? That seems a little dramatic. Seems a little dramatic to me. Come on. Come on. Best game ever? It's a super stream game? It is? It's not too bad. 85, 360. I mean, this I I perform well in an environment like this, I guess. Cause I'd be, you know, somewhere somewhere around number four or five, depending. Yeah. That might work if it's a good game. Well maybe I'll try it out. Maybe I'll give maybe I'll give it a sample. Give it a sample, see what I think. Looks interesting. Yeah, it make I'm, I normally have trouble getting interested in a game until I like understand the loop. In your lo oh no, my trash rocket! No! You've played Hades, right? I love Hades. Hades so good. Could do some Hades runs sometime soon. This is a good freaking game. Bye bye, little ship. Whoopee! Yeah, this this I have watched. I have watched you play this, Darren. It looks cool, but I already own it, so that's rad. That's rad. Looks kind of neat. Yeah, I bought it when it was released, and it was the Twitch meta. <laughs> See, you're watching. You're watching the meta. See, right now, um. Right now, V Rising is meta. V Rising is meta. Raft is kind of meta. I guess it's probably already gone because it's just an update. Updates for games don't stay in the meta for long. Updates don't stay for long, but new games, that's that's where it's at, man. You said, uh, it's like, I've liked, I've liked Dead Cells. Yeah, Dead Cells is supposed to be very good. I already own that too, I think. I think Akima got me that one as well. Hellblade Cinema Sacrifice. Now that's family friendly. Now that's a family friendly fun, fun time. I mean, this is also not very like, it's not very dark, like very, very, uh, very uplifting gameplay. Very heartwarming. It's a heartwarming tale of a mother and a daughter and the struggles that they go through and the love that they have for one another. It's a very empowering game. It's sure to rise your mood up above zero. Um, but you said psychological horror. No, Baba, Baba is you. I like puzzle games. Goose game, good. Goose game, good. <gasps> I know what we need to play. Delta Rune. Or the other one, Underworld. Tail. Dude. I still haven't ever played Undertale. I still haven't beat this game. We need to play this. I only played it for three hours. We gotta finish it. I wanna hear the I wanna hear bone trossel again. I want my bones to be trossled! Every bone, every trossel. I just need some more I just need some more sands in my life, let's be honest, man. Yeah, we must, we must play this. Slay the Spire, good! I've got that too. I've got that too. Uh, Slay the Spire is pretty fun. Wizard of Legend is really good. I have that on Switch. I do not have that on PC. You know what this looks like? This looks like, um, particularly in the shading, it reminds me of Antichamber. Have you seen that? 
Yeah, this is kind of impossible geometry. Yeah, this this is definitely giving me antechamber vibes. Oh, except for antechamber is a little less empty. This game looks much more sprawling. Uh, this looks like a trip, dude. This looks like acid trip for free, man. This is the safe way to enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> this music is wild with this trailer. <laughs> this is like, it's like Mario's world is coming to pieces. This looks crazy, dude. That's wild. That one's going on the wish list. <gasps> Detective Rach, what's up? Oi, I'm glad that you like the hair. I'm glad that nobody's hated the hair so far. Or nobody said it anyway. As long as y'all keep it to y'all selves, you know? If you don't have something nice to say, then, well, you can kind of say whatever you want. Fall guys. Artificial Life AI 2061. It's been deleted off the store now. Do I have Fall Guys on here? Is there any like... So it's free to play now, really? I feel cheated. I bought this game twice. <laughs> At request of the publisher, it's no longer available on Steam. What? Is it been canceled? It's been canceled. It was moved to Epic, wasn't it? Was it moved to Epic? Did Epic steal it? Oh, gross! Yuck! Epic took something off of Steam? Ew, yucky. Yucky. So I can't use my copy on Steam? Ew, the Epic store is so sticky. I don't like it over there. It's like, it's like, it's better than you play and it's better than Origin, but it's gross. I mean, I have it, because there's some games that you just can't, you just, you can't play Fortnite on Steam, but no epic for me. Heroes of Hammerwatch. I played the original, ooh, I played the original Hammerwatch, but I don't think I have Heroes of Hammerwatch. Or I'll, I'll just look up Hammerwatch. Yeah, I was one of the beta testers for the original Hammerwatch game. I got like a key before it was on the store. Tested it out and gave them some feedback. But this is this is a different thing. It's a roguelike action adventure. Okay, the other one wasn't roguelike, I don't think. This is probably roguelite, rogue pardon me. This might be fun to play with you, Darren. You say this game's good? Seven different classes, a hundred different unique items to play, co-op with three friends. New game plus construct buildings and upgrade buildings. Ooh. Dung and Thropa? Oh boy. So which one's which one's better? Which one's better? Dung and Thropa or um Persona? Which one's better? And be honest. Would it be better to play Danganronpa or would it be better to play Persona 5 Gold? Which one which one's better? That's a tough call. Yeah, I mean, I know that they're both supposed to be very good, but I don't know if I've ever heard anybody say that Danganronpa was better. It's quite fun. You put 100 hours in in less than a month. But yeah, but Darren, but you're a juicer. You're a juicer. You're a grinder. Maneater is also free on Epic. Maneater is a shark game, right? That's like a shark munching simulator. This is like, this is a game that I'd love to play when I was 12. When I was 12, I'd be like, you could be a shark and it's got gore, dude. It's got gore. You can eat whales. I mean, shouts out to the 12 year olds, but you're banned. Darren put in a hundred hours, so it's so-so. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to put it like that, Die. I didn't want to put it like that. You didn't have to do you didn't have to do Darren like that.
ancestors. This monkey game was kind of interesting, but it didn't, uh, it didn't like, it didn't grab me. It didn't have a good grip, ironically. It's just like a game where you're a monkey. You're just a monkey. And you like, smell things and hear things, and walk around and hit things with sticks. And you breed. And you have hair, and climb, and think, and learn. It's like an interesting concept, but the game itself was kind of a snoozer, dude. Fight in tight, sp tight spaces? What? Is there any good, like, physics games that you can think of? That's what I was thinking of. Like, a game like Human Fall Flat. I guess we just need to- we need to get a group together and play Human Fall Flat. I don't think that the OT group has done that yet. Maybe we can get Salty... ...and... and maybe Human 1... Examine to do it! I bought that game because you suggested it, and it is jank! It is a janky game, and it's not done! It's not done, and they're never gonna finish it! They're never gonna finish it! This game is jank, dude! It's a hard physics-based game. Yeah, I've watched you play it a lot. It is so janky! It's got a weird perspective and weird control scheme. It makes... It, it makes getting over it seem like a really simple experience. Humans fall flat was fun. Yeah, it looks like big fun. We should we should play with friends. Maybe maybe we could maybe we could play it with Harvest. Maybe that's uh, the first Harvest game that we play. With uh, if if we could get Drewby to get it and Rimage and Obst, that would be kind of fun. That'd be kind of fun. Bunch of humans falling flat, slapping each other, grabbing each other off the edge, throwing each other off the off the railing. Oops, grab this box with me. Oops, I dropped it. <laughs> I I can I can see the drama now. That seems like a good 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 team building exercise. A really, really troublesome game where you can totally screw over the other players. Now that sounds good. You think you have human fall flat? Mmm. Want a, a physics game that's super cheap? I already have super flight! I already <laughs> <laughs> I should have known I already had all of Darren's suggestions. Darren, you mention games and I just buy them. You don't understand. Okay? I already know that you know what's up. This game is wild. This game is wild. Darren has a really, really consistent game base where Darren just plays like super duper difficult, fast, difficult to control, janky games. They're not all janky, and they're not all fast, and they're not all hard, but they're all a mix of one of those things. I guess two of those things. You're given a, a key by a friend of a friend? Well, it's only three bucks. It's pretty fun. It's just you, it's just a super fast zooming game. We just fly super fast, and you try to make like near misses and stuff. It's pretty fun. Yeah, the more near misses you make, the better, and you like, so you, so you want to weave in between the boxes and everything. You want to get as close as possible, but it's randomly generated, so you never quite know what you're gonna, what you're gonna fly into first. Just cutting corners, getting close, and then you uh, accidentally land and you explode. Light, relaxing, casual, atmospheric. Is there not a uh, procedural generation? Physics, I guess? A lot of these physics games are probably going to be builders and stuff. Yeah, builders and sims. There's Noita. Noita. Untitled Goose Game. I have that on the Switch. Wobble Dogs looks weird. Oh, this game looks weird. I like it. This looks like a good version of Spore. This looks like Spore, but not garbage. Have y'all seen this game? Grow and hatch your own unique wobble dogs? <laughs> Do they evolve? Is that how this works? You have to like pet them and train them and feed them. Crossbreed them to make new mutations. <laughs> Whoa! Baby Loon says that this game's good. I've seen somebody play this. It looks very strange. 
<laughs> Aww. Look at these little puppies. They fall in love with one another. And you'll fall in love with these wobble dogs. Looks like it's base management. I wonder what the point is. Is the point to like find every breed? Maybe you earn money for like selling them. Or maybe you're supposed to make, a the only thing that I don't like in games is whenever you have to make your own ending. Like I'm just, I'm, I'm just not the kind of guy that just plays a game to just play it. Where I'm just like, I like these mechanics. I'm just gonna play it. I want, I want there to be a point. I want the game to give me direction. I, I don't have the self-confidence to strike out my own path. I, well, I mean, look at this. It's got achievements. That's good. Flora field guide is the hardest thing to do. It's just to breed chaos. It's kind of cursed, but there's no ending. I mean, got 72 achievements. That's good. That's good. Dai, you also smashed every Pokemon that came up. I don't trust your judgment. That's true. <laughs> That's true. Die. Die with every Pokemon that I went through. I'd be like, eh, pass. Be like, smash. Hook smash. Oh, wait. I need to put that on the... I need to put that on the wishy. I'm putting this on the wish list. I'll think about it. Wobble Dogs looks fun. And Baby Loon says that it's chaos. I like the sound of that. <gasps> what is this mom game? What is this souped up mom game? This looks like... This is Peggle. This is Poggle. For the true gamer. Peggle for adults. Peggle adult version. It's a lot like... It's like reverse breakout. It also looks like a uh, pachinko. This, this game looks like what I would play on mini clip when I was a kid. This looks like a flash game. Souped up flash game. Uh, Wobble Dog. Oh, let's see, is there any other funny, funny games? People Playground. Ah, oh, it's too violent. That's too violent. You kids can't see this. Turn your eyes. Oh, yeah. Teardown. Teardown's got some updates and stuff. Ooh, I was watching that boy Ugu play this. Oh. It's got achievements now. Ah! <laughs> it's got achievements. <laughs> you guys, our time may have come. Our time may have come. Got achievements now. That's a whole, that's a game changer. That's a game changer right here. Get a, get a full score on Skeet Master 10 times. 10 times? You do the practice, you do the practice mode 10 times and you get an achievement? Oh boy one of those games but seriously it's got achievements now that might be enough to pull me back in this is a wild game is it like it, it basically you have to become a speedrunner like you have to use speedrun tactics to play this game like not to just beat it but just to even pass any of the levels you have to have like speedrun techniques you have to like set up your escape routes you have to you have to knock down walls and make it so that you can like speed around and then you because you have to hit a timer and you have to grab all the loot and get out in time. It's a very interesting game. Hey, zombie food. What's up? Oi, 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 oi. Oh, yeah. That's the other thing. That's another re zombie food reminded me. Another reason that we need to raid somebody in a minute is because I need to set up that seven days to die server. Because I bought a new one that should run a lot better, and I need to I need to generate the map. Um, into the breach is great. The perfect solution. Wait, what is this? Everything. What are they so worried about, huh? <gasps> Ooh, the perfect solution. <laughs> Just explode everything. That is the perfect solution. <laughs> uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Hollow Knight? I couldn't stand Hollow Knight. Too Metroidvanian for my style. It was like, I really like the combat. I like the bosses. 
I like the bosses, and I think it had skills which were fun, but it's it's uh its map was way too twisty. Oh yeah, this game's supposed to be really good. I I like FTL, and I've liked a few like DS games that were like this back in the day. Back in the day, we had some like there was a DS version of Age of Empires that was set up like this. That was an isometric um, strategy turn-based game, and it was really fun. I actually enjoyed it. it it's the bite the bite-sized versions I can play. It's whenever the turn-based combat turns into like a proper RPG that's when I say no. But a game like this, maybe this is called like a tactical turn-based simulator or something. Is this tactical turn-based? I can do that. I can play this, that. I could play, um, there's another game like this too that's turn-based that's really fun. Um, XCOM Enemy Unknown is good too. I, I like XCOM. But I don't, I, I, I just don't like RPGs that have turn-based combat. Like, I don't know if I could ever play Dragon Quest. I feel like I should at least try it. And we never, we never solved whether Danganthropa or Persona 5 would be a better game to play. Maybe that's a, maybe that's a, like, problem, problem that we solve when we get there. The Shadowrun games are like XCOM Enemy Unknown? Mmm. Well, I haven't even beat XCOM, so. <laughs> but that's good to keep in mind. What kind of game are we looking for? I'm just kind of shopping around, Baby Loon. Just kind of, just kind of poking around, poking around and thinking about stuff. I like lots of different types of games, but, um, I'm also looking for games that would be fun to stream that are like a, a unique experience or like a funny idea or are like really engaging. I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of hard to explain what makes a good stream game, and I'm not the best at picking them out myself. So, yeah, this game looks like this. This is crossing the line. This is now crossing the line for me. This is too far. This is too turn-based for me. Nope. Nope. I can tell I won't like this. I can tell. It has too much, too much from this perspective. XCOM feels like XCOM feels like missions. It feels like it's a base, it's a base management sim. Like that almost feels like it's its core. Like the core is a base building and research and training, and that's kind of fun. And then it just has missions that you go out to and they have very clear objectives and you just have to like get good with the strategy. But this looks like, this looks like a whole freaking game where you can't walk. Maybe I'm judging it a little, a little too quickly, but it just looks like a game where you're not allowed to walk around. And that's never fun for me. Yeah. You just, it's just a game that you don't get to walk in. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't, I don't normally like things like that. Binding of Isaac is intense. Binding of Isaac, I've never properly gotten good at that game. I've never, I've never just like sunk the raw time into that game to understand what, what mixes together to make a good run. I've played Repentance for how long? Not telling me. But whatever I've put into it is not enough. I played 13 hours of this one. I played I played 13 hours of each. So I played 26 hours and I still don't get it. Still don't get it. I I, I just have not reached the point where I understand how the runs really work. I, I've beaten some big stuff, but I just have to dig more into this. I just need to play it more. But it's really fun. It's super dark though. And the stream used to not be PG-13, so I was uncomfortable playing it. But I'd, I'd feel a lot more comfortable now. Um, oh, it's a banger, it is. And I uh, I really love the art style and like the dark humor. Really, it really adds like an extra edge to it. Um, you said, have you tried the Binding of Isaac? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what was I trying to read? You said for me Persona series, but Danganthropa was a close second. Okay, well at least we got at least we got something on that. Texan bread, what's up? Yeah, we're about to we're about to head out. I just want to hang out for a little bit longer because I had to start late because of my hair appointment. But tomorrow we should be back on schedule, probably. 
Um, Kenshi is heckin' amazing. It's a little different, kind of unforgiving. Kenshi, I always confused with overgrowth. Yeah, overgrowth, overgrowth and Kenshi are forever mixed up in my brain for no apparent reason. This is like a hyper-violent bunny, bunny gore simulator, where you're like bunnies that fight, and it has realistic bones breaking and stuff. <laughs> I don't know what it is about. It might be the development process that, that makes me think of these two, because they both had unusual developments, I believe. Kenshi, I believe they were both early access for a long time. This game looks like somebody looked at Oblivion and they were like, what if we made it even more, like, unnecessarily complex? Wait, what? Oh, is this an RTS? Simulation, is it? Oh, it's open world RPG? No one show Lin's overgrowth. Well, I mean, you play as a bunny. It's only bunnies killing bunnies, I think. Right? This game is so crazy. Like, it's physics. They, this is one of those games where they had so much fun doing the, like, doing specific parts of the game, like, making elements of it. What is it called? Like, they made all these gameplay elements so perfect and they refined them so much but they completely forgot about making it a game. Like they made throw like everything super realistic, super interesting and satisfying to do, but there's no point in doing anything. It's 100% open world. They have some scenarios, but you have to make your own scenarios and there's like there's no story. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Very ketchup like though. It really does look like red paint. What is this music? <laughs> is that one of the developers' bands? Is that the is that the developers' band? It's like, yeah, I do programming, but I also write music. This is David Rosen from Old Fire Games. Oh, David. David, are you the singer in that band? That's pretty good. A game with no point? Yeah, <laughs> that's what we gotta look out for. Kenshi is... Tekken amazing. It's a little different and kind of unforgiving. So is it like a, like a strategy RPG game? It's not just a game. The world is the game, not just the setting. An emergent gameplay gold mine of the second video. To live is to struggle. Wait, 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 wait. We need sound. This sounds epic. <laughs> oh no. Why am I laughing at the starving man? He's on he's on death's door and I just can't help but giggle at him. He's just walking funny. <laughs> he died. Oh no. Oh. Slave for the powerful. This is Mad Max looking zone right here. Don't give up. Struggle on. These NPCs look like Mountain Blade. A bit better than Mountain Blade. Lose your squad. <laughs> that's a that's a feature. You know what? You can even lose in this game. Oh no! Rescue your squad. So aggressive with the exclamation points. Lose them and then rescue them. You'll never win the game otherwise. Explore. I like some of these environments. Very Mad Maxian. Base building. Grow stronger. Like with more people or with like better weapons or with like, like, like you level up or what? Go to war. Look, look at these band, look at these band of munchkins. Look at that band of munchkins. I wish I quote the derisive giggle as someone dies in front of you. You wish that you could quote it of me going, <laughs> it's just, just look at him.
Look, he's perfectly healthy. Now he's dying. <laughs> it's just the one-two punch of this. It says, to live is to struggle. Then look, he's chilling, having a good time. And now he's dead. <laughs> he's dead. Also, his appearance reminds me of Jesse from uh, Breaking Bad for some reason. He doesn't even look like him. Maybe maybe it's his face. Maybe it's his cheekbones. But he looks like Jesse from... He looks like Jesse from Breaking Bad. Mr. White, we're not going to be able to cook anymore. Oh, Mr. White. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's why I laughed, okay? Oh, my God. Jesse. Jesse. We have to survive. <laughs> Mr. White, I don't feel so good. I may have puked in my mouth. Blech. Okay, this is a great time to end the stream. <laughs> as soon as we make the first Breaking Bad reference, that's when it's time to go. Wait, wait, one more game. We should look at one more game. And on that note, we need one more game final one tiny tina's wonderland oh boy oh boy <laughs> nothing better than a little bit of comedy in my games tee -hee, very funny uh one more game you guys what's the what's the last game that i should look at and possibly add to my wish list final game mm. look to kenshi <gasps> bug snacks this game was supposed to be good, but I thought that only the the power of the PS5 could run this thing. I thought that that no old generation console could ever run such a such a hardy game, such a PS5 exclusive. What is it? Tell me that this Muppet game can run on my computer? Not likely. <gasps> what? Is that donut walking with sprinkles? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This changes everything. That donut walking around on its little sprinkles. Whoa, it's a butterfly. It's a pizza butterfly. Hey, Ahsoka, we'll see you later. Thanks for chilling. Oi, oi. Ahsoka, have a good night. Ah, oh, he just ate that little creature. Clumbernut. Wait, I want to hear what Clumbernut sounds like. Delicious thing in the world. You haven't lived until you've tried one. Elizabeth Megafig. Is that... What is this anime dub sounded voiceover? Two-bit con artist. I know who you are. Look at that donut. You're the journalist. We have too many journalists. A pasta and lobster. Aww. Monster fires. You don't know a thing about love. That's why your wife left you. Shoot, dude. That's that's low, dude. Whoa. <laughs> that's why your wife left you. Left you. I'm gonna do violence to you. As long as we got bug. I had heard about how the game has like a bunch of adult-ish like themes and problems that are just mixed in. <laughs> Baby Loon, thank you for the follow. I'm glad that you're enjoying the vibes around here. Why? We will be back tomorrow with more nonsense. Nonsense, I say. Now, of course, we're looking at games on Steam, but I also want to remind you, Paper Mario, Mario RPG, those are both so tempting. That little pink muppet goes hard. Snacks will be fine. That's sassy. Damn your crib, dog! It's the Whoa. queen of bug snacks. Whoa! Why would bug snacks? Is that a sushi? Oh, he's got a Squidward nose. <laughs> he's got a pickly Squidward nose. Have a monarchy. Oh, Wambus is just the title. She's got pineapples for arms and burgers for for ears, <laughs> and a sub sandwich for for. <laughs> For a mohawk. Our end is nigh. Is, is that a metaphor? <laughs> These voices. You weren't expecting anything less for someone who could do a, a do a go birdo voice, huh? A birdo voice. What are you talking about? Go birdo. Go birdo. <laughs> <laughs> Or do you mean right now? For we're coming, Liz. Let's get to it then. So you become wait, do you become a snack? 
You become a snack? Do you slowly transition into a snack? Oh my god. Oh my god, this game's darker than expected. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait one flea flickin' second. Wait a second, who are you? Baby Loon, who are you? Wait a minute. Wait a minute, I don't know who you are. You're somebody special. You're somebody special, and I don't know quite who it is, but... Yeah, because let me just check something. Let me just check something right now. You must be, you must be a special kind of person. You are a special kind of person. Ah, an insider. Okay, now shush. Now shush. No secrets. No speak, no secrets. Hey. All right, okay, an insider. I see, I see. Look at these little bugs. Look at these little babies. Sure should I been? Oh no, you're good. I'm just teasing you. I'm teasing you. Ew! <laughs> Yuck! Wiggly carrot can't hurt you. Wiggly carrot. Yucky! That's what happens to carrots if you leave them out for too long! Ew! <laughs> and it looks like those little noodly... <laughs> the little noodly floofy things that, that move on their own! That's disgusting! <laughs> Some of these creatures are cursed! Everyone's talking about... Everyone's talking about oh, it's got... It's got... <laughs> It's got birthday candles as its legs and a birthday cake as its body. Oh, it's stick bugged. <laughs> There's so much good stuff in this trailer. Get stick bugged. Can't believe I got stick bugged in a game trailer. Celery stick bug. You can upgrade house? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. If you can upgrade your house, you know that I gotta love this. Now wait, now look at the list of things. It's got, it's got quirky humor, physics, base building, and collection. This sounds like my kind of game. Together, you and I will share the incredible tale of Bug Snacks. It's got that weird, it's got the weird vibe that's in, um, that's in the Rolly Ball game, the Katamari Damacy. It's got like a Damacy feel to it. The physics are weird too in Demasi a little bit, and in that other game that uh, that's made by the same devs that I always forget, the Sushi Dragon. Okay, this this looks super fun. I think this is what I'm gonna buy with the with the money that's on here. Psychological horror, yeah. What tam? That's what it is. Okay, Mike. Yeah, that that is extra extra like bug snacks. I think. What tam is so strange. You can you can walk around as a toilet guy where his mouth is a toilet. And you can control a little poop. This game was so much fun. I'd be tempted to play this again someday, but I have to forget like how to do stuff. We need to take a break from this before we play it. A longer break. This is such a such a trip. Ew! Look, see? He eats the poop. There's poop eaters in this game, and there's, like, children laughing at all times, and it's a little unnerving. This feels way more like <gasps> Balloon Wonderland. Oh. Is that on sale? <gasps> Balloon Wonderland is on sale for only $11. Lie like a lie and lie like this game. I want to play this game so bad. 
the best way. What is with this trailer voice? Because the best way to solve Bell and Wonderland is to delete it. The best way to play Balan is to never play it at all. This summer, Square Enix tries to rip off Mario Odyssey with Balan Wonderland. All of your powers are worthless. Give up before you start. Unskippable cutscenes. And uh, what's the other thing? It's called... Uh... Quick time events. <laughs> vacuum clean, <laughs> vacuum cleaner powers. You can be a vacuum cleaner. The music's jamming though. Dude, I'd play it for the soundtrack alone. Uh, me and my boyfriend, whenever we drove to, whenever we drove to Las Vegas, we listened to the Balan Wonderland soundtrack. Every single instance of music in the game, we watched back to back, and the and they copy the songs. The songs repeat, <laughs> and this and the dances repeat too. They they just copy over the motion capture and the music throughout the game, and sometimes like levels one after the other repeat the exact same song like they don't even they don't even go like one two three one two three they go like one one two three one one <laughs> two two it's so bad there's only three songs in the game <laughs> or maybe four counting the end <laughs> it looks so bad this is a torture game. This is a this is a 24-hour game. Maybe we can make this a game for a 24-hour stream. We can make it a torture stream. We can make it a torture stream where you where every gifted sub or every five spins a wheel of pain. <laughs> And then, and it uh, either impairs me within the game or it or it gives me pain in real life. I could have, whenever the wheel gets spun and it's something really bad, I can make the lights flicker like fire. <laughs> I wonder how long this game is. Can you finish this game in 24 hours? How long to beat? <laughs> I'm liking this idea. I'm liking this idea. 24 hour ballet in Wonderland, you could do it. You could do it, it's only 11 hours long. Even with all the extra things that I'd want to do. Even with like the extra spins and the hell mode, we could totally beat this game in a stream, easy. We couldn't completion it though. <laughs> maybe we could just play it in entirety. Maybe, maybe we don't want to, maybe we don't do a 24 hour stream, but it's 100% it, a 33 hour stream? Zach, you know that half of that's just gonna be the quick time events. Every time that you, that you collect the hats in the game, which is like three per level, you have to do the same quick time event over and over. You'll rage quit within an hour. You would be surprised, Bonehead. You'd be surprised. I have a lot of, I have a lot of stamina. I have a lot of stamina. Look, I, I, I would, I'll play getting over it right now just to prove it. I'm going to play one getting over it and then we're officially done, okay? Then we're done, done. Then we'll find somebody to raid, but I'll play getting over it once. Where is it? Hey, what's up, Splat the Mouse? And hey, Positivity Boy, what's up? Yo, check the hair. Check the hair. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Getting over it. Yeah, we'll play we'll play one time. One time. One time, one time. <laughs> Subathon. Subathon, the longer it goes, the longer I have to play it. Sub seven getting over it! <laughs> I don't think so. Sub seven? I thought we made it I thought we did better than that, right? I, I wasn't planning on speedrunning it, but I could just go ahead and 
I mean, I might as, might as well slap it on screen, I guess. I'll move the daily goal that we're not going to reach out of here. Open splits from file. What? What'd that say? New update. Show only something files. Fixed an issue. Do you want to update? I'm just going to say no. going to give you wiggle room. Yeah, we have to I mean sub 10 is necessary. Sub If it's not if it's not sub 10, it's not acceptable. Oh, thank you, Akimik. I forgot to do that. Yeah, we'll just we'll just play one Oh, my mouse feels weird again. Why do I keep changing my mouse settings? Is it is it the DPI or is it the in-game sensitivity? I can't tell. My mouse feels slow, so I'll... Okay, that feels a little better, but now it's too sensitive. Ugh. Oh, boy. Okay, I'm just gonna keep it slow, I guess. But don't feel right. Feels... feels really slow. Ah! I wonder what my uh, record is. It's not showing it on the list right now. Ah! Okay, well, all I gotta do is just beat it. All I gotta do is beat it in under 10 minutes. Then we'll call the night. All right, the stream's already gone on for too long. I'm getting hungry. Ah! Ah! Wait, the whole thing? Yeah, we'll get over it. Got a lot of practice in this game. Ah, even though it's not looking like it right now. Yeah, we'll get over it. We'll get into space. Oh yeah, I had a new technique here, but I can't. I don't know if I can do it with the settings how they are right now. It's supposed to go up like this. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah, ah, no, yeah, <laughs> ah, <laughs> Urgh, why is this so hard? Up, uh, up, uh, up, uh, up, uh, up, uh. this technique feels harder, but it's way faster. Uh, there we go, oh my gosh. No! No! My opportunity! No! <laughs> Hey, what's up, uh, Chilico? Oh god, that's never where you want to grab. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, I'm <laughs> so dumb. Why? Ah, uh, the game's lagging. Why is the game lagging? It's such a simple game. I can feel it. Oh, it's S Flare. Hey, welcome back. Boy, how have you been? I remember you. One opportunity. If you had one shot, one opportunity, would you take it or slip down the mountain? Uh. Knees weak, arms spaghetti. His oil on his hammer are ready. Feeling so sweaty. <laughs> Snow on the mountain are ready. Spaghetti. Oh, ah! No, 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 no. We need the, uh, we need the shortcut to skip. That's the most important skip of the game. That right there is the most important skill for you to learn. That is number one. Speed run number one. Oh. No. Oh, you love the new hair? Thank you. It got done today. I'm sure that you guessed that by the title, but... Yeah, got done today. Bleach three times. Mamma mia, mamma mia. Mamma mia, crunchy hair. Cr crunchy hair. Let me go, crunchy hair. <sighs> All right, here's where it gets hard. Oops. Wait, didn't I have a special... Didn't I have a special technique here that I figured out? Yeah, you can grab on that edge. Get good, that's what you do. That's something that I could not do previously. 
how we're going to get uh, below five minutes at some point. Not today, but at some point. Uh, yeah, and I've really got to I've really got to work on my like little extra hops, but I can't I can't really do that right now with my mouse settings as they are. Oop. Unfortunately, they just feel wrong, and the game's like acting weird and lagging. So we'll beat it, but I won't beat it at a high speed. Feels imprecise. It's a very sensitive game. I'm a sensitive man, and this is a sensitive game. Ah, pain, pain, dude, pain. Up, up, up the mountain we go. Ugh. There are so many better ways of doing this, but I just can't do it. Not right now. Ah! No, I was a fool. I was too ambitious. Too ambitious. A problem I've never had in real life. Oh. Ah, I hate this jump! I hate this jump! All the solutions for this jump are so difficult to pull off. God dang it. God dang it. <laughs> God dang it, boy. Oh, oh. There's so many ways of doing this, but I'm bad at all of them. I've tried like all three different methods that people use for speed runs, but I just don't do them well. <laughs> Frick! Frick! Dude, this game's impossible. Nobody should play this game anymore. People beat this game in three minutes. There's some people. There are some people that would be up the mountain twice by now. It's not a, it's just not a game that you can beat. That's a bummer. That's a real bummer. It's just not beatable. Oh, ah! <laughs> the hat got you. You're better than this, lad. Listen, I'm telling you, these controls are janky. I don't want to blame the hardware, but I noticed it immediately. Frick, did. Now this part is not hardware related. I don't think. I mean, this is already a hard thing to do. Rip crap out of here. Definitely if I wanted to learn better methods than what I just did, it would take the hardware acting better. But, yeah, admittedly, I wouldn't blame that on the hardware. Alright. Now we just gotta make sure that we don't fall. As long as we don't fall from now on, then we'll be fine. There we go. Oh boy. No problem. Gotta stay calm. Don't overcorrect. You overcorrect and you're going to heck. Hey, yo, ends me. Thank you for the raid. What is up? I just messed up. Oops. Whoops. Hey, yo. What's good? What the heck were you doing? Oh, you're playing getting over it as well. Sweet. Yo, what is up? Are you a speedrunner of this game? Are you good at this game? Thank you so much for the raid. It's nice to meet you. Hi there, uh, JK Junkrat, Nikki, Inz, Rika, Courteous Rat. Nice to meet y'all. Hello there. I'm further than you. Oh, first playthrough. Oh, I see. I see. That's the that's the most fun. It took me like, oh my god, it took me like 20 hours to beat the game the first time. How long have you been playing it? You're playing some other stuff, but now you gotta go to bed. Yeah, oh, get, go get some rest then, my friend. Thank you so much for, for raiding in here. Thank you so much for the raid. And uh, yeah, enjoy your sleep. I'm glad that you got to enjoy the game. I'm, I'm doing the same thing as you. I was not playing this the whole time. I just I just decided to turn it on just for fun. Ooh. Said only like an hour or so, but you'll be back. Heck yeah, you've got this. Let me tell you what, ends me. you've got this. Just learn slide skip. It's my suggestion to you. If you learn slide skip, there's nothing that can ever get you down. It'll teach you, it'll teach you all the skills you need. But yeah, rest up. Thank you again. And uh, Raiders, you're welcome to chill with us if you want to. 
we're just going to play a little bit of this, and then we're probably actually going to raid out as well. But if you want to watch me, I'll, I'll climb up this mountain one more time, because this is not a satisfactory run. This, is, this does not satisfy me. This makes me very upset. <laughs> this game's been, uh, been treating me kind of nasty. Ah, oh, see, I'm being dumb now. It's me again. Thank you. Enjoy your rest. It was nice to meet you. Oh, frick. I hate this mountain so much. There's invisible holds that you have to grab onto. Fruiters is back. Oh, thanks for the follow, Inzmi. Dang, a raid and a follow. That's Now, that's just too wholesome. That's just too much. Let me up. Oh, my God. Somebody not tell this guy to put a jacket on? Boy, it is freezing up here. Your nipple's gonna fall off. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. There it is. Oh my gosh. You can just memorize all of the holds on that mountain. And you can just go straight up it. But I always have trouble remembering where they are. Alright, we're going to space. Oh, thank you so much for the follow! Okay. No, 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 no! No, it's supposed to aim up. Oh, it's still probably faster than normal, but oh, it's supposed to aim up and to the left. What a waste of time. Wasting time in space hurts the most because it's such a simple. All right, there it is. No sub 10, so we got to go again. Thank you so much for the follow, Nikki. Welcome to the party! We're gonna do, we're gonna do another, we're gonna do another try of this. That was a super good radio tower, you're exactly right. Yeah, what, what was the time there? It's funny that it says like plus, it's not, I don't think that it's comparing them quite right. Yeah, one more, one more. Alright, we gotta get sub 10. We have to do sub 10. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt. Cats, I actually really love this game. This game's very fun to me. It's a, it's a game that I thought, like, unbeatable, and then once I beat it once, I was like, huh, I wonder if I could beat it a little bit faster. And then I was like, maybe a little bit faster. Then I noticed that there's an achievement for beating it 50 times, and I was like, well, I could do that. It would just take a long time. Then I kept getting faster, and I learned some tricks. And I've looked up some speedruns. But uh, I still don't know lots of the methods for how to play this game. There's like this uh, little underhanded swooping motion that <laughs> that speedrunners do that is kind of like let's see, it's it's like it's like this kind of it's like that little hop hop. And I um and I cannot do that right now, not at all. I like. If, if my mouse feels really good, I'll occasionally pull it off on, like, snowy mountaintops and stuff. Ah. See, you're supposed to do, like, a little hop off of this thing and grab onto that paddle. And I get it right sometimes, but most of the time, I'm just, like, big swinging. Okay. Hey! You just knocked that crap out of me. Hey! Hey! Go that Zach! What are you doing knocking me around? Oh my god. Hey, Peter. Peter, I blank getting over it. Oh yeah. Goose goes boys, boys for goose go. Goose go bark, perish about Man, this is a bad. <laughs> ah! <laughs> no bad tree! No bad tree. Must get good tree or else. No! Yes! 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 Oh, yeah! Go! Go! Good tree! Good tree! <laughs> this mouse feels so wrong! It's supposed to be more sensitive. I'm having to move my hand around so much. Hey. Frick! I know perfectly well that this is my normal functioning. Normal. Okay. I'm changing the settings a little bit. Let me adjust them. 
Anaya, what the heck? Yo, thank you for the raid. What the heck? Anaya, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How was your stream? Much love for Anaya Falcon. Wholesome friend of the channel. It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a while. How have you been doing? We were just chatting. What were we talking about? Anaya. Anaya Frick. Why? Why do I keep punching the wall? Oh, it's gotta be... We gotta pull down. We have to pull down. I'm messing this up. I'm messing this up. Oh, you're building the Millennium Falcon. Oh my god. That one's like 700 pieces. And like $700. No, it's more than 700 pieces. It's like 3,000, 4,000 something. It's way more. That is awesome. 7,000. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. You didn't even realize that speedruns existed for this game? Oh, Daunt, you'd be surprised. This is actually one of the most sped run games in, the, in all of speedrunning. Uh, number one is Minecraft, I want to say. That might be inaccurate. I can't remember. Minecraft is one of them. Mario 64 is one of them. Then there's one that I never remember, but this is like in one of, this is one of the most sped run games. I mean, this game's made for speed running. Like it has a timer built in and everything. It's very convenient. I'm even using an auto splitter. I don't even have to, I don't even have to split them. Like the speedrun community is wild. It's also like its depth of gameplay is crazy. Zelda, yeah, Zelda's gotta be it's gotta be majorly up there, you're right. It's probably it's probably even it's probably ones that are before this game that I'm not thinking of. Okay, so the sensitivity is helping, but now it just feels like super sensitive. Now I'm having kind of the opposite issue, but it's honestly a better issue to have. I'd rather it be overly speedy. Ah! Ah! Oh yeah, now that Anaya mentioned that, I want to do some Lego building sometime. I want to do some Lego building. It's so much fun. I hope you had a wonderful time, Anaya. If you need to go get some food or some water, please take care of yourself. Take care of yourself. You put 24 hours into it? Into the Millennium Falcon? Oh my gosh. The most time that we spent on a Lego set, I think was... Oh wow, that was a crazy lucky jump. Um, the most that we spent was three streams, I think? Three streams of at least eight hours? Okay, I'm being dumb, I'm being dumb. Better to be patient and just pogo. Oh my God! If I had just been patient, I would have been fine. I was trying to like practice stuff. I was trying to practice fancy moves. I need to just do like a vanilla run of this and just just get below just get below 10. Okay, so I'm being done. I I just need to slow down. Not going for record. Not going for record, especially not whenever I just changed the settings. Yeah, calm down. Get sub 10 and I'm gonna feel good. At least not on stream. You do it off stream, but it's a lot on stream. Oh, do you do it? You would do this off stream. It's a lot on stream. Oh, you're saying that you're mostly building it on stream. Yeah, that's gonna take forever. <laughs> that's so many pieces. Now the Ninjago City we did all, all on stream. I don't think I put a piece in it that wasn't on stream. That is, yeah, kind of exhausting. They were like, they were three eight hour streams and that was me building as fast as I possibly could. Which with Lego, that doesn't always lead to the most like fun building experience. It's not even like a way that I would recommend to build. I just, that's just kind of the way that I have to do it. Oh, ah, that's a bummer. That one, that spot gets me often. Yeah, because that's what you're supposed to do, but I'm always tempted to like start a little bit higher and then it just puts you into a more awkward position. All right, remember, we're just going for a 
clean run as he messes up. Clean run. Uh, I know that there you're supposed to pogo, or you you can like pull on the steps and get this jump instead of pogoing. Basically, every time that I like pause and put the hammer underneath me, that's me not speed running. Like that's there's there's no pogos like that in any good run of this game. They, they just don't make that move. They're always using like momentum to go faster. Uh, you said, yeah, it's bedtime. It is late. Anaya, thank you so much for bringing your community over here. Thanks for bringing your peeps. Hope you get some good rest. It was good to it was good to see your name and chat with you for a bit. Excited to see your Millennium Falcon build. I must be I'm throwing because I'm so sad that Anaya is going to bed. It's because I it's because I was like, oh boy, Anaya is here, and then as soon as I heard it, I was like, ah, oh, I don't know if I can beat this anymore. Oh, Darren's watching me. The pressure's on. Fellow, fellow climber. Fellow climber. Been at the top many times. Oh, no. Oh, baby. The Witchly Boy. What's up? Uh, this is the fastest way, but I'm still not good at it. Uh, yeah. Whoa, that was a weird, that was a weird physics thing. You've been here the whole time? I'm sorry, you got quiet. I'm sorry, I didn't notice. There were so many blue names. Darren, listen, I, I, I care about you. <laughs> the witchly boy. You just had a night terror wake you up? Oh no. No. No night terrors. Night terrors are not the Krabby Patty secret formula, so stop eating them. Oof. Oof. I'll eat your night terrors for you. Can we get some Minecraft munches to eat up all the bad dreams? Okay, I'm feeling it. Oh, I felt it! Sorry. That's not an eating sound. <laughs> the whistly voice says, Ooh! That's a Darren sound. <laughs> okay, these god dang rocks. <laughs> dang stupid slippery rocks. This part haunted me for... <laughs> this part haunted me the most! <laughs> This is the worst part of the game. Those rocks. <laughs> Moving out in a month. Don't care. <laughs> what the heck? Oh my gosh. Everything else is like no falls. It's just like maybe a little slow. Like maybe a little slow, but... But not... Okay, well, that was a cool. Good guttural screech? I don't know what that means. Does guttural mean, like, deep? You mean, like, a like a Nazgul screech? I'll give me my best Nazgul. You mean, like, a pig? This game sucks. I'm a hide. BRB, me hiding. Yeah, I had forgotten about the box. My keyboard is at the bottom of this uh, cardboard box. Oh, hello. Hello. I'd like to go up, please. Up, please. Yes. Yes. Up, please. Up, please. Thank you, Rick. Yes! Up! Up, 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 and a frick! Okay, I need to calm down. Ooh! Spicy. Yep, 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 yep. Oh my god, that's so fast. So fast that it messed me up. Stop doing that, dude! He 
said slickly to himself. Stevens, please. Go up. Up! Steven! What if your hammer gets in the way? Why can I do this part well? Kind of. Ooh. Steven! Steven! <laughs> no! Oh, Steven. Oh, what? What? You can do that? What the heck was that, dude? That was crazy. I can't do it again. It's a one-time opportunity. What the heck? You guys, I'm about to quit streaming for good. This is, gotta be it. This is it. Final stream. It's too much. Oh. Kind of like that. Listen, you guys, Twitch is just not working out, alright? I'm gonna get a job at Chick fil A. Nails the pan flag colors every day. Oh. Ah! Oh, no. You guys, I'm. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to beat this again. I beat it once, but I think my brain has melted. I think my brain has been refined in the smelter. I think that my brain has been compressed. I think that it has been squeezed, ground up like a fine cough. <laughs> I hear good things about their pickles. I don't even like pickles. Pickles aren't even that good. They're just okay. <sighs> what's, what's the big deal? Oh, that's nice. You know what? Maybe this game's not so bad. Come to think about it, this game has offered me unique opportunities of entertaining myself. And it rewards hard work, which every government should do. Oh boy, oh boy. Pickle myself into a Chick-fil-A pickle, Morty. Morty, Morty. We have to cook pickles. Oh, I'm dumb, dude. I'm dumb, dude. I'm a dumb dude. There we go, now that's the money. That's the money. Oh yeah, baby. Hello, I'd like to go up. Freedom fries, dude, freedom fries. Here we go, here we go, okay. Up, up, up the stairs we go. Then, a tunnel. Oh, uh, hello, I'd like to go forward, please. Hello, I like, I like money. I like money. No free napkins. The other first reward. Can I go home now, Mr. Krabs? Oh, free. Frubby Bubby. You guys, that might be it. That might be it. I don't know if I can take any more of this. 
I don't know if I can take no more of this. Hey, what's up, Eldritch? Boy, yo, we got the hair going on. Look at this guy. Look at this guy with his suspicious mop. Look at that head-based mop. Oops. Eldritch, how are you doing? How are you doing? My favorite crow. My favorite Boyd. My favorite Boyd. Listen, we have some other Corvids that show up in the chat, but they're just... Listen, nothing can beat Eldritch Corvid. I'm sorry. Listen, nervous Corvid, if you're out there, it's just that Eldritch is here all the time. Okay, you guys... Eat the egg. <laughs> the egg? You mean the orange? <laughs> some SpongeBob sound and music, dude. favorite Earl. Oh. Wait, was it an orange? The thing that I like, that I pushed with the hammer? Yeah, that's orange. That's why it's called Orange Hell. That's what that zone is called. Oh, I guess it's just called orange on these splits, but we all know what it means. Dude. When we die, where do we go? We go into this man's pot. We go into this pot, and then whenever he climbs over the mountain, then we go to Valhalla. But there's all these human souls that are waiting inside of this pot. And if I don't get them to the top, then they live in purgatory forever. Everyone that ever quit this game has left over 10,000 souls each. We must complete this game for humanity. Otherwise, you must be some sort of monster! Yeah, I could totally beat this game. I'm just being a stickler because I want to get below 10 minutes. Being a stickler because I want to do better even though my brain is melting. Normally, I do a first run and then that gets me all warmed up. Then I can go fast the second time. Sometimes I'll do a really good first run and it's just like kind of out of the blue. But normally I'll start getting worse at like three or four. It's the power of the lick. <laughs> the lick! All right, lick. Give me all the power that you have bestowed within you. All the power of Mario Kart is surging through me. The power of saxophones be with us. We'll meet again. Amen. Alright. This is a fine spot to be making mistakes on. It's just those rocks. I just have to make sure I don't make mistakes on the rocks. We can easily get sub 10 minutes as long as we don't fall. Hello, up. Hello. Hello. There we are. That's something. Oh my god, I almost flew off the edge. That was a bad idea. So is that. That was okay. Okay. God! I'm gonna practice that one more time. I'm already up here. It actually takes me a little while to get here. Like three minutes. If I make mistakes on the way, then I won't do it either. So, I mean, I'm trying to do the speediest way, but maybe I take a little safer to get 10 minutes. Not do anything crazy, but still make it. God, why am I getting stuck here? Hello? 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 Oh, yeah. You do that. I forgot. Hello? Ring, ring. Are the physics on line one? Okay. So the slower way of doing this is to demand that I make it up to that rock off of this jump. Like this. The 
Sometimes I'm gonna miss, but at least it like lands consistently. But the faster that I need to do, the faster way that I want to practice is you hit the like corner of it. But I don't know if I can do that right now. I don't know if I have it in me. I don't know if I got the power. Even with the power of the lick. The lick has forsaken us. My most trusted companion through all my most troubling times, the Mario Kart lick. Seems to have abandoned us. Well, maybe, maybe the luck has has just soaked into our bones and it won't appear until the time is right. Maybe it's maybe it's deep in our marrow now. And it's just waiting for us to tap that power. When the full moon rises, the Mario Kart licks powers will fully manifest. And I will turn into a were gamer. Dumb old dumb old slidey block brick thing. Okay, we have to be like a tiny bit further. There we go. Hello? Ooh, that was a really weird little clean edge there. Finally, a straight edge in the chat. Oh, you're gonna go to sleep, cats! Thanks for chilling! Oi, 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 oi! It was so much fun! I'm sorry, I, I drug out the stream for so long! Now people gotta go to bed! Ah! We can still do it. That's only a few seconds. Cats! It was so nice to chill. Enjoy, enjoy your, the rest of your night. Whatever's left of it. Mighty night. Much love. <laughs> Gonna recover. You said you got the good serotonin. <laughs> Wet sleep, boy. Enjoy your night. Enjoy your sleep. I hope you have good dreams. Hope you have good dreams. God dang it. So hard. Yeah, Die! Buddy. Yo! Can we get some hype in the chat? What the heck? Guy with such extreme Dying generosity. 101 gifted, gifted a tier sub. Sub to the cat's Thank you so much. They have given 101 gift subs. 101 gift subs! Die, an absolute pillar of the community. Thank you so much for supporting me. Die. Oh, Die, every. The baby is back! Cats, enjoy your sub! Enjoy your sub! Oh, Mika Brandon, what's up? What are you doing, Mika? I'm trying to beat this game. Yeah, die 101. Now you're not allowed to gift any more subs from now on. It's perfect. Oh, see, that's what happens. That's like the worst outcome. Just did the same thing, but kind of recovered. Okay, it's only 10 minutes. I'm like going way fast at the beginning and then I'm just, then I'm just, uh, sucking. We woke up today very early. Yeah, what the heck is, what the heck time is it right now? Oh. I woke up pretty early this morning too. So that I could get my heart in. And I sure am happy that I did, because it took forever. Can I not do slide skip? Here we go! Yo, JPEG stripes! What's up? Do I look like I know what a god dang JPEG stripe is? <laughs> I do actually. There we go. Oh, mommy. Oh, daddy. Perfect. Okay, watch this. 
Yes! Finally! Holy moly, now we beat the game. Ah! No! <laughs> I'm sorry. Ow! No! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Why am I throwing at this one spot? Why? I've beaten this. I've beaten this like more than 60 times. I've beaten this like more than 60 times, dude. How many times? It's not even hard. I'm just throwing it for no reason. No reason. It's just exhaustion. It's just exhaustion setting in. It's not even a hard game. I beat it. I could just beat it every single time. It's just that I'm rushing it. It's just that I'm rushing it and not wanting to repeat anything. So I'm just re so I'm just resetting and resetting and resetting and resetting and not really getting any proper practice in. But I shouldn't need practice because this game is easy and I've beaten it a bajillion times now. And at very high speeds. I'm just a little rusty, that's all. I'm just a little bit rusty. My muscles, my muscle memory is getting back, especially with this new, um, with this new sensitivity that I'm dealing with. I made a, I made a sensitivity d uh, change this evening. Very, very stark one, so I'm basically starting from square one. Though I suppose it's even worse, because I was getting used to what the other one felt like. I could have easily gotten sub-10 with that setting, but this is way better, because it's, it's much easier to control. Failed there like three times ever. I've fallen there like three times in my 40, 35 hours of playtime. You gonna get some sleep? Darren's a Darren's a working wizard. A working wizard. Get yourself some rest, my friend. Thanks for chilling. At least nice to see you. Much love to my wizardly friend. Can we give a shout out? For Darren one more time. You guys, old wizard's been a little more busy. A little bit more of a wizard. Having to get work done. So make sure that you give them a follow so that you don't miss when they stream. He does contact juggling and has a cool wizardium and plays really cool hard games. Kind of like this one. Be back tomorrow. There you go. Streams tomorrow, it's the perfect time to follow. I would say that Darren's better at this game than I am, but is less practiced than I am. If that makes sense. Darren has the, the mental faculties for this game, but just lacks the practice that I have. But I get, um, but I mauled way easier than he does. And whenever you mauled, you're not learning anything. Like it's just not, it's just not useful. I guess. I mean, I guess any practice is practice. Especially with a weird movement like this game. I guess even, even if you're like mad, it probably still counts. You're probably still building up muscle memory. I was kind of counting on that slide. I just didn't know it'd go so far. I actually find this way trickier than slide skip, but I guess slide skip requires like such a specific movement. It did take me like, I want to say 20, 30 minutes of straight practice to be able to get slide skip for the first time. 
Which, if you think about it, it's like a lot, a lot of time for just doing one jump over and over. With a high speed recovery here, I could probably still get sub 10. I don't know. I want to say last run. I want to say last run this one. Because by the end of it, we'll have hit the five hour mark. And we already got a win tonight. Yeah, this this run is the run. I will I you know what? I'm gonna pull out all the stops. This is the run. This will be sub ten minutes. I'll just I'll just make it happen. It's just it's just required. It should be like yeah, see I get better at tap if I could get better at tapping on this edge, then I could I could do some real sh movement. It's fine. We take our time because this runs the run, so there's no need to feel rushed. Come on, freedom press, freedom of the press. Second amendment. Beep, bop, boop, skibbity, boop. There we go. Come on, Bennett Foddy. Oh yeah, that's what I need. Good point. We should just turn on the narration. That would do it. I just need to hear him say, oh, that's a long fall. That's a that's a real bummer. Whoa. Okay. I need to keep remembering that this hammer is super sensitive now, so I can really okay. screw myself over. Hey! Shiny, did you just wake up? Hey! Shiny woke up and chose violence. I woke up, but chose violence. Shiny! Mm, shiny. I'm playing a hard game. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Go, go. All right. First time. First time rocks. This way. Easy. Straight up. Easy. I use ye olden method. Oh, I even slipped on the old method? That's crazy. These rocks just hate me tonight. It's a movement. It's a movement that I'm doing with my wrist. I'm just straight up doing a movement that's antithetical to that specific spot. I'm just in some sort of a habit or I'm just, I'm just holding the mouse in a certain way that's just messing with me. Something's up. Something's up because I don't... I don't normally have this much trouble on that one spot. In fact, I didn't even earlier. That'd be when I switched the sensitivity that I, I was using it as a crutch or something, some movement. It's a very sensitive game, so even the slightest air will get ya. See, that right there, that's the movement. That's the problem, is whenever I should be pulling like straight up, I'm not. But I'm going crazy. We're gonna find somebody to raid. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm going mad. I'm going mad. Okay. We're gonna raid. Save splits? Nah, fam. I ain't saving any of that. Alright, we're gonna raid Juby. Juby's playing Spyro. Spyro's really fun. We have 100% Spyrail. Spywell. <laughs> Spy Spywo. Spywo the dragon. Gonna go say hi to Drooby. He's part of my stream team. He's really, really cool. 
He's really cool and really sweet, and I can't wait to meet him in real life. And he always helps me out, and he's a real nice guy. So we're gonna go over there, and we'll say... Harvest time! Harvest time! Yeah, I'm gonna go eat some dinner! I'm really glad that I got to stream you guys. I really did have a great time, even though this part, this very ending was a little frustrating, but I really had a great time. I'm so glad that I streamed tonight. Lots of fun. Thank you guys for the, for the subbies and for the support and for vibing in the chat and for talking. Honestly, people that chat, y'all are, y'all are my beloved. Thank you so much for talking with me and keeping it entertaining. This is the most fun thing that I always do in my day. So thank you for being part of it and for hanging out. It always means the world to me, and uh, I love all y'all. We're going to go say hi to Drooby. Pass on some of that love to another homie that absolutely deserves it. They play lots of games. Much of them are uh, retro. And it looks like we got some peeps to get in there and make a party out of it. So I will see you guys over there with Drooby. And uh, remember, take care of yourself. Drink lots of water. Lots of fun things coming up. I'll be here tomorrow, hopefully right on time. I don't have a hair appointment tomorrow, so it should be easy. All right. Good night, everybody. Thanks for hanging out. Daunt, it was nice to meet you, I think. Did you follow today? I think you did. Uh, Mika, good to see you. Best Olivia, so glad that we got to hang out with you for a long time tonight. Jedi, thank you for watching over the chat. Thank you for the compliments. The hair's a little crazy, and I love it. Oi, Kodak Zach, much love to you. Can't wait to meet you too. Uh, Eldridge, good night. Enjoy your sleep. Uh, and Divey, alchemic and shiny. Thank y'all for being here. All right, peace. Peace, love. Take care of yourselves. Bye. Oh, wait, Baby Loon, it was also nice to meet you. Bye bye. Oh yeah, and I also have to stop my stream. Tee -hee.